What's up? What is up, everyone? How's it going? Hope you all are doing amazing. Because, uh, I sure am. So, we're gonna start, uh, I, I, I uploaded video of the, of the, uh, sort of a clip breakdown of, uh, the last one that we did. And I'm probably gonna do it again at some point, but I'm not gonna do this one. I'm probably gonna do, like, the next three. And I'd like to start streaming this on Mondays, so, at this same time. Which works out for me, so if you guys are down with that, that's what we're gonna start doing. Uh, the ad jump scared you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um... I am on time. I'm actually on time today. Uh, so basically, basically always on time for Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, uh, <laughs> except for last time and every other stream that I've done. So uh, <clears throat> I notice you, Carl Wilker. What's going on? Howdy, y'all. So um, yeah, of course. Thanks, Justin, for showing up. Um, or justice, sorry. Uh, Narf for the Narf God. Yeah, really. That's, I see. That's what I thought the name originally was. Was I thought it was like Narf, like like blood for the blood God. I thought it was like Narf for the Narf God, but it, it had something to do with chickens, and I it, we just lost control from there. So, um, is that a naked vampire you see in the distance? Sure is. <laughs> Picking up right where we left off. <laughs> so this should go well. Um, Riz up Carlock. Yeah, I know, right? How's Marcy? She's great. She's she was teething all week, so uh, I think she's finally coming off of teething a little bit. Some of her top teeth are coming in, and that is really painful to have bones push through your mouth, and it's bad. And she wakes up in the middle of the night, and she sharts everywhere, and <laughs> not everywhere, but she uh, teething teething is teething is not a good time. So I feel bad for her, but. She'll be better. She'll she'll be she'll be all good. What what did we multi class again? You guys didn't multi class at all, actually. Uh, well, Narf Narf did not multi class. Asterion is a rogue warlock, and Shadowheart's a cleric ranger. So why is he naked? So Asterion, let's 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 get into our you know our little recap, I suppose. Uh, last on on Baldur's Gate. Um, Oh god, hang on. I have a I have a chat overlay and it's in the middle of the screen and it's gonna bother me. Hang on. Let me fix that real fast. Yeah, I don't have to do nearly as much troubleshooting as last time. Uh oh, there's a there's a button I can push to toggle. Well that's great. I love that. Okay. Um Okay, that that summons it. Oh oh no, what am I doing? Okay, let's, uh, there we go, positioning, that's much better, okay, okay, so, uh, hello, there we go, okay, sorry, none of you can see what I'm doing currently, <laughs> alright, so, um, last we had left off, y'all, we, um, we got off the Nautiloid, we made Narf Narf, the Mud Chicken Usurper, which didn't fit, so she's TMCU, of course, and, uh, we got off the Nautiloid, found Shadowheart, you know, made friends with her, but took her, um, circlet, as you can see, we, we've, we've got that circlet on, looks great, and, uh, found Asterion, killed him, <laughs> And then brought him back to and then left and then brought him back to life, but stole his clothes. And now everybody, everybody really wants him to be uh, naked. Okay, so I'm looking at the chat right now, and oh, last thing, last thing, bribe we also to kill the Asterian. Bribed to kill Asterian again. I, I see that. I see that. We, we will get to that in just a moment. I just, I just want everybody to to recognize that we do have the birthmite. Um, Cranberry's birthmite, as it would be. We are just the inheritors of Cranberry's birthmite. Okay, so um, there's a lot of kill Asterian again in the chat, and uh, this will be the entire game if we allow it to be. So because it's the beginning of the stream, and I feel so gracious, uh, we we will give that one final vote. And uh, if if <laughs> if this does not decide <laughs> whether you guys will leave him alive or not. <laughs> 
we may just need to stay dead just because no one can decide. Uh, you know, I don't need to do this. All right, so the poll's going up right now. You can vote one if you want to. Uh, oh, there's a poll underway already. Hang on. My my poll is, is all broken again. Give me a sec. Um, but again, it's going to be not the, don't, don't vote on the non-lethal one. That, that's, that's, that's not real. Cool. All right. Yeah. Can we, um, can we, can we, can we, can we just, can we just. Bigger bribe to not kill Asterion and put clothes on him. <laughs> okay. We'll make that an option. That'll, that'll definitely be, uh, something we do. So, it says I've already got a poll going, and I definitely don't, so, uh, just give me a sec. It does not... Bribe to kill the Naki vampire alive. Bribe to kill him alive? What, what is that? What do you mean? Kill him while he's alive? Because that, you know, that, that, that would be, that would be correct. That would be right. Oh, you poll. There's not an option to see an active one because it's bugged out because it thinks there's one that's active, but there isn't. So it's just like, no, you already got one. And it's like, no, no, I don't. I don't, I don't have one at all. There, there's, there's, isn't, there's isn't one. So... Welcome to the first 15 minutes of the stream, everybody, where we troubleshoot. This is everybody's favorite part. I know it's my favorite part, and it definitely, uh... Okay. Okay, there we go. There we go. I pushed... No. Don't do that. That's not the right... That's not the right pull. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's try this. Nope. There we go. I fixed it. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay, so you can vote. There's there's a lot of there's a lot of discussion in the chat right now about killing him or not killing him or just keeping his clothes off. So here's what we'll do. You can vote one if you want to kill him. You can vote two if we're going to leave him alone. You can vote three if we are going to. What was the other option? What do you? You guys are maniacs. What? <laughs> or or. To re bigger bribe to remove that new option. <laughs> what, what were all these bribes? Not to kill him and put his clothes on. Alright, that, that's bigger our... bribe to remove that new option. <laughs> you can't bribe to remove options. It's yes and. <laughs> it's, it's, we're, we're, ru we're running off improv rules. Alright, vote one if you want to kill him. Vote two if you, if you don't want to kill him. That, then we'll just do that because we'll split a lot of votes. So right to open the secret menu with Alt and F4. Uh, ooh, ow, 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 ow. This, the secret menu with Alt F4. Okay, that would have been funny, but it would have just wasted a lot of time. So I didn't do it. But yeah, if you guys don't know, there's a secret menu in Baldur's Gate 3 if you press Alt, Alt F4. Okay, polls, polls live right now. Vote one if you want to kill him. Vote two if you don't. We'll get into more specifics with two. But, uh, yeah, uh, vote three is nothing. There's, you don't even get to see your results. <laughs> don't vote three. Vote three is a waste. <laughs> Whoa, we got a, we, there's, there's a lot of, lot of, we, we've got a lot of opinions on, on a, on a Starian living or not. It is a big decision, uh, which we continuously want to keep making, but you know, Narf Narf can't really decide the all of the wrinkles in her brain. You know the intrusive thoughts just keep pulling themselves forward, and she has no idea. I gotta turn off every, that it lets you know when you vote because I think it's slowing down the votes. Okay, two is one, so we're not killing him, which is great. We went through a lot of effort <laughs> to not, to keep him alive. So instead, what we're going to do is we're now going to vote, um, we're now going to vote, uh, you vote one if we're going to keep him as is. So you just leave him, leave him naked. And then vote two if you want to put his clothes back on. That, that's the new poll. One, to keep him naked. Two, to put his clothes back on. Because this is, this is the pinnacle, 
the the optimal Baldur's Gate 3. It's the best Baldur's Gate 3 stream anybody's going to find out on the internet. Here we are in the first area of the game voting on Asterian's clothes. Larian, I hope you're proud. Multiclass him into Paladin. Keep his oath. Keep him a good boy. No evil stuff. That's interesting. You know, Rusty Brown wants to throw in the idea of maybe making him a paladin. Um, so when we get withers in our camp, if we get withers in our camp, we will uh, be able to respec. So always float that option in case you guys just want to change their classes. That's a little down the road. So maybe we make Asterian a paladin, which would be pretty interesting. Rogue paladin combo is pretty crazy too. You could also just make him a full paladin. That's an option. Okay, so we're going to leave him naked. <laughs> Great. He's naked. <laughs> Good stuff, chat. All right, let us continue moving. So, uh, like I said before, I'm going to be pushing us sort of in the... in the Bribe to like this stream. Bribe to like this stream? Thank you. What a, what a, what a great bribe. Bri bribe? You know what? I will. I'll like the stream. Everybody like the stream. Uh, the, the Martian bribed everybody for it. It wasn't even a bribe for me. Unless I don't like my own stream. Make him a barbarian so he gets unarmored defense. That would be funny. Okay, we're going to loot these goblins because I know you guys want to loot absolutely everything until our we're over encumbered, which is totally fine. Um, and then, okay, so we, we do have like two directions we can go here. If you guys um, look up at the map up here, you know, we've got two directions because they, they made the map a lot better in this game, um, which is great. If you're going to so. make him a paladin, might as well give him the oath of throwing it back with all the skin he's showing. <laughs> The oath of throwing it back from uh, from uh, one shot questers that um... oh one shot questers you know them they made the, the oath of throwing be it back. Chat makes major decisions. This should be chat is Jacob's intrusive thoughts. The, honestly, kind of how it feels because everybody keeps blaming me for all the decisions. They're just like Jacob did it. I'm like I guess I just let the intrusive thoughts win. Um, so vote one if you guys want to like go left, and then vote one if you want to go right. Um, this is left the right way that to make a starian an oath break. I don't think it's capturing my my uh, my 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 mouse. Hang on. Left is wh whatever you see left as. There we go. This is left. This is right. This this way this way is right. So you vote on that. One is left. Two is right. <laughs> One is left, two is right. Right, turn alive the gith lady. She says mean things to us. Mean things? Yeah, I guess she does. Make the rest of the party bards? Oh, it was the other one. Bride can make Asterian an Oathbreaker. That would be really cool if Asterian was an Oathbreaker. Um, that, what an interesting story he, he would go uh, down. Make he would the go rest down. of the party bards so they can be Naf Naf's cheer squad. <laughs> Giving him, giving uh, uh, Narf Narf, she's just getting tons of inspiration. Uh, <laughs> Narf Narf just gets beefed up. Um, okay, so we're gonna go left. Is this what we, is this what we're cool with? Always right wrong way first. Starian a Nicker's necromancer. He just wants to raise a family in peace after all. <laughs> yeah, Asterian's definitely a a, a, a family. Uh, he, he's he's the family guy, except that they're all. Um, Necromancers, uh, not necromancers. He's a necromancer. He's got a bunch of skeleton children. Yeah, that would be that'd be funny. Um, there's so many different ways we can go here right now, but uh, you know, guys, there there's two sort of major directions here that I sort of have to have to get down. But we've sort of decided ride to go to this way. Ride to with coconut shells and ride him like a horse. <laughs> Larian, where's the option that lets us do that? Come on. Um, we're going to torture this man. We're going to like, we're going to give him a cool story of being a paladin, but he's still going to be naked. And then we're going to ride him. Okay. Um, whoa, what's going on over here off to the right? Uh, we're going to, we're going to be choosing a lot of directions right now. So we could, we can go right or left up to you guys. And we're, um, <laughs> I'm going to, I'm just going to make a new poll. That's just right or left just so we can have that. And you guys can vote right or you can vote left. Instead of me constantly changing it between one and two. Uh, we'll make it 45 seconds. And there you go. Vote, vote, vote right or left. Um, left is, is this? No, this is right. This way is right. And the, uh, there's somebody over here. 
Whoa! And then left is this direction, which may lead to something, I don't know, just kind of looks like a forest in the distance. I definitely didn't play 200 hours of the early access, and I'm trying my best not to spoil it for anybody who hasn't played the game, but it's weird if this is, if this is the only way you've played the game. If this is... I need to know if none of you, if some of you have never played this game and you're like, this is the experience that I want, because that is impressive. Um. <laughs> if only we could have coconut shells in this game, and then Asterion could be perfect. <clears throat> I have never seen this game before. Wow. I'm very, I'm very surprised by that. Okay, so we're gonna go right. Sounds good. La 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 la. Zoru was right. Yellow is a toad, twice as ugly. Is the game quiet? The dangerous. Is it difficult to hear? To kill. And if it escapes, how will you? Oh. Again. Yes. Okay. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. The lips don't move. It's Enough good. It's all right. Teeny bit quiet. And the guard raven chicken. How's that? Shadow heart is there too, I guess. Narfrath the pimp with her side piece Asterion and the guard raven chicken. Shadow heart is there too. Yeah. Ex yes. It's exactly what's going on right now. It's very interesting. Okay. We're going to vote on dialogue. Oh, I'm sort of in the way here. Sorry. Uh, let me just move myself over a little bit. Uh, okay. Dialogue. Go for it. So we got a lot of options here. We have quite, quite the array. Number one is rather demanding for uh, a woman in your position. Why should I? Number two is, uh, don't worry, I'll get them out of here one way or another. Three is a deception check. The creature's dangerous. Four is a persuasion check. Shoot the trap down. Or we can do five, which is a monk option persuasion. The Githyanki's an intelligent creature just like you. Release her and let us converse civilly. Which is very rational, uh, calm decision coming from Narf Narf. <clears throat> Because that's exactly who her character is. Why would I question that, Jacob? We only stripped Asterion of everything he has. <laughs> I am nothing if not merciful. <laughs> we did let 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 uh let let him live, I suppose. All right, number five sounds good. Um, the Githyanki is an intelligent creature, just like you. Release her and let us converse civilly. Was there a sixth? There was a sixth and seventh option. I'm so sorry. We have to revote. There's a sixth. I didn't scroll down. Sixth option is uh, is attack the tieflings. Then seven is leave. So number one for um, conversing with Lizel and tell her that she's being demanding. Two is don't worry, I'll get him out of here. Three is a deception check. Four is a persuasion check. Five is a monk persuasion check. Six is attack the tieflings. Seven is leave. We got it, guys. <laughs> it's, it's going great. <laughs> we know what we're doing. Everybody who bribed for gameplay last time, here it is. Here's your here's your riveting gameplay. That was the loudest sip. It looks like we're still going that monk option, which sounds good. All right, you think the good thing is an intelligent Let's creature. Chat. Let's kill Lizel again for cranberry. <laughs> you guys never killed Lizel. Cranberry never killed Lizel. He just just left her up there because she wouldn't say please. <laughs> Uh, the Githyanki is an intelligent creature just like you. Release her and let us converse civilly. It is a persuasion check of seven. Let's get a little guidance from Shadowheart here. And then... There we go. There we go. We took her armor? We did? Did we really kill her? I don't remember that. Did she die in camp? What happened? I, don't, I barely remember that. Alright, here we go. How do you vote? Whenever there's a poll, you push exclamation mark vote. And then you put whatever the options on the poll say. Sometimes it's one, sometimes it's a word. You just have to look. But we succeeded. Converse with it. I barely know what it is. <coughs> but Demace, if it's intelligent, we can't just... Hells, this isn't worth it. I'm out of here. <laughs> They're just leaving. <laughs> Enough gawking. You Get stun locked them, chat. Okay, so now we can say... Um, no, you could vote one for, now that they're out of earshot, sure. Number two is say please. Number three is leave. <laughs> I think, I think I know the, 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 well, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe, maybe 
Narf Narf's a little more forgiving. I don't, I, it's funny because Narf Narf is forgiving when it comes to, and like any other NPC, but the second it's the, it's the other characters, she's like, I'm taking your artifact. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to make you say please. <laughs> Narf Narf's really sassy when it comes to the, uh, comes to the, comes to the companions. And then it'd be funny if you guys just, like, were really nice to one of them. Just, like, you're just really cool to Will or Gale. Alright, it's two. <laughs> Say please, Lizel. Never. <laughs> well, <laughs> do I even need to ask? <laughs> Observe and listen. Guys, are we getting her down or not? If you vote one, then we will get her down. If you vote two, we will not. Leave her. Kill? Kill. All right, vote three if you want to kill. If there's a ton of... Wow, there's so many votes for three just from that one little thing. <laughs> just from me saying it late. There's so many votes for three. There's so many. <laughs> She didn't say please. She, you weren't polite enough, Lizelle. It is time to die. <laughs> oh my God! All right, sounds great, everybody. Um, <clears throat> Lizelle, <laughs> Asterion has nothing. He can't even do a ranged attack. He's gonna have to do his fame presence. I forgot he's a warlock. How do we kill her? With the crossbow? Alright. I mean, I mean that works. She's in the cage, so... Um, Lizelle, you didn't say please to us. You'll regret that. Oh, wait. Should I use the poison? Vote one if I should use the poison. Vote two if I shouldn't. I just... Quick, quick poll. Quick poll. W vote one for poison. <laughs> How brutal do we make this death? <laughs> I find it horrid that Jacob forces us to vote. I choose to be bi-pancreatic. <laughs> By pancreatic? Look, my playthrough on my own is is going okay. I, I've I've done some bad things, but I think it's working out for the best. Um, killing Lizelle on sight because she—I well, guess not on sight, but just because she didn't say please—is honestly kind of based. <laughs> We're gonna use poison. Wow. All right. Poison it is. I've already used it, so... We're just gonna save real quick, just in case. I don't think she's gonna kill us, but... Control yourself! <laughs> control yourself! I have no... I have no way to control myself. <laughs> Vote one to loot. Vote two to leave. She had it coming? That's true, you know... Aboard that, aboard that non-alloyed, you know, Lizelle was giving us a lot of demands. And, you know, now that, now that we're in the opposite position and she won't even say please, to be honest, she kind of deserves to die for that. Narf Narf is nothing if not merciful. <laughs> but Narf Narf is also nothing if not a usurper. It would be hilarious to leave, just leave her there. <laughs> Revive her? Guys, we're gonna do this every time. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna kill every companion except for Shadowheart and revive them to like establish dominance. We can't that's insane. Okay, let me shoot the thing down. Oh. Narf narf, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> she fall like that. Uh alright, give me all your stuff. Jeez, God, this is this is horrible. <laughs> okay, um, <laughs> uh, so vote one if you want to revive her. Vote two if you want to, to leave. Make a wear underwear. <laughs> okay, we'll vote on that in a second. We gotta vote if we're gonna revive her or not. Vote one for revive. Vote two for leaving, and then we'll vote to see if we're gonna put a in that in that underwear because that's what everybody on TikTok has been saying to put put. I staring in Lizelle's underwear, which is pretty funny. Arrived to revive her after. Have to teach her manners. I have to teach her manners. 
this is so different than cranberry like this is just so like you guys you guys are out for vengeance you, you <laughs> the most the most respect that you can cull from each from each companion is is what we're going for so we're reviving her all right twenty dollars to revive her Twenty dollars to revive her, guys. It's it's it's. If anything, you're bribing chat. All right, You'll, you 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 can't sway the polls. All right, we're 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 a, we're a democracy here. <laughs> I create the polls, and maybe I'll take bribes to create polls, but not to sway them. Okay, uh, hang on, hang on. Are we putting? I don't think we can put a steroid Lysol's underwear because I think it means I have to. Uh, I think it means I have to turn like the nudity off because it just keeps them on there yeah because <laughs> i don't think i can unequip this but i have the nudity turned off so i'm not sure uh Mouth yeah it's is here for one thing to teach people manners. to teach people manners yes that's true you're we're monk way of the manners that that makes sense you kill people you bring them back we're gonna run out of revivify scrolls is what's gonna happen um Okay, I don't know if I can... I think I can switch it if she's in our party. So let me do that first. Black stream and try. Okay, fine. Give me a sec. One moment. Let me quick save so I don't ruin everything. If I take off Asterion's under... I just can't... I just... Okay. There's a leaf. <laughs> Guys... If this is a democracy, then I can definitely bribe and rig the polls. Oh, you're right. Sorry about that, Reptilian Danger. You are 100% right. Except I'm the only one running this. So there, there isn't like a committee of people who can be bribed. Um, so, but yeah, um, I guess we're a... I don't know what kind of government we are. Um, okay, everybody has to see this. <laughs> he has a leaf over him. <laughs> it puts a little leaf. <laughs> it's so funny um okay so uh can i just well i can't give him <laughs> greek god yeah i know i'm afraid to turn him around <laughs> uh only leaf yeah i know i just feel like his cheeks are gonna be out and i don't think youtube's gonna like that um I don't have Lizelle's uh, underwear, so I think I I think I'm, I'm gonna have to put this back on him, and I'm gonna <laughs> revive her real quick, and then we can swap him. Take two okay, you're alive. You were careless with your weapon. <laughs> Let us hope the tadpole has not scrambled all your senses. <laughs> and the longer we wait, the more it consumes. All right. My people possess the cure for this Bribe infection. to leave him with only I the must leave. find a crash. You will join me. Kevin. I would norm. She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. Oh, oh. She sees her kindness as weakness, guys. She's still looking down upon Narf Narf. She didn't learn anything. She just she was just like, "Wow, you're dumb with your weapon." Basically, uh, I'm unfortunately not going to take the bribe to leave the leaf because. Hang on. Let me let me go. Let me go. I can't go dark stream yet. I'll do it in a second, but we need to vote on, on dialogue here. <clears throat> um, so number one says, and what exactly is a crash? And then number two says, all right, we journey together. Let's find this crash. And three says, we'll go our separate ways, I think. Um, look, uh, I know Larian's like, there's technically no nudity, but uh, you YouTube's pretty strict. I don't know if you guys knew that. So... <laughs> I may have to veto some of these bribes. <clears throat> she's gonna. You guys are voting too, which is that she's gonna journey with us. What an interesting strategy we have with the companions, which is primarily to uh, make them respect us, and if they don't, kill them and bring them back. All right, cool. So yeah, all right, we journey together. Let's find this crash. You have made an ally from Crash Kalir. You know such fortune. All right. Call me Lazel. I'll trust okay. your judgment, but I won't trust her. Nuff, nuff, rocking the Gatusius hairstyle. Mm -hmm. Also, out of all the companions, Karlak deserves all the love in the world. 100%. Half elf. 
I love Carlock so much. Lost on a creature like you. <laughs> Guys, they're the arguing. The camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. Okay. Well, she leveled up, guys, so we'll do that in a second. But uh, let me go dark stream to see if I can switch their underwear because that's something everybody wants. Um, what happens if I do this? Yeah, okay. God. Bribe to not veto bribes. B <laughs> it's like wishing for infinite wishes. <laughs> Bribe to not veto bribes? Guys, we'll get the the, I, I, the, st the stream will get pulled. <laughs> Truly, cha the chaotic the chaotic neutral of chat. The real enemy is me. Um, okay, is this what you guys want? Is this? Yeah, I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna vote on this. This is very clearly what everybody wants. All right, it's it's here. Great job. Look at him. Is it? Are you happy? <laughs> Let's get going. I am in. <laughs> He likes Lazelle. He likes Lazelle so much that he'd wear her under. <laughs> what have you guys done? What have you done? Oh, bribe to play on a naughty website instead. <laughs> just yeah, we'll just we'll just stream to 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 just somewhere else. Just to do, we'll do the after dark one. Guys, look at his look at his butt. <laughs> this is horrible. This is bad. I've, I my my channel is a great streak of never being demonetized, and YouTube for the first time would be like, "What are you doing?" And I'd be like, "It wasn't me. It was the chat." <laughs> Boote. Yeah, yeah. All right. The the badonka donks are out. Bribe the dump to play on a naughty website instead. <laughs> the, the 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 dump trucks are out. <laughs> We gotta level up Lizelle. Um Let's do that real fast. So, uh, very quickly, everyone, let's vote on whether we're going to multi-class her or not. You can vote yes or no. Bribe to... <laughs> I don't know what you guys want to put Lizelle into, but, uh, you know... I think it'd be funny to 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 put her in. Actually, out of all of the companions, I think Lizelle fits the most to maybe multi-class next to one that's later that I'm not going to spoil. <clears throat> there's right a, there's... To go back, please go back. Go, go back, go back to what? Go back to looking at Asterion? Is that all you guys want to do this whole stream is look at him with his leather straps on? <laughs> Make her a bard? That's so, that's, that's so chaotic and really funny. That's so against... Like, Lizelle couldn't be anything further than a bard. You guys just... Narf Narf's like, you study the instrument now. Sorry. I make the rules. Is this an undies party? I guess so. God, me undies should stream the... Should, should sponsor this stream. <laughs> Bardbarian? That would be funny. We can't respec yet, not until we have withers in our camp. But once we have withers, then we totally can. All right, we're gonna multi-class her. Um, what do you guys want to multi-class into? Uh, oh, I gotta get rid of fighter on this one, and I gotta add um, bard barbarian. I gotta add cleric because that's what we did with uh, shadow heart, right? Or is cleric on the other one? No, cleric's on the other one. I gotta add um, rogue. Hey, what's up? Oh, yeah, you're fine. Is she asleep? Oh, nice. Guys, guys, the baby is asleep. So that means Spencer's going to play Baldur's Gate 3 on her own. You can come say hi to chat. They put... Look what what look what she's wearing. Do you know what that means? Bribe for tax breaks for the oil and gas industry. Bribe for tax breaks for the oil and gas industry? You guys really are playing into this being a, a capitalist democracy. <laughs> uh... Yeah, uh, they, they, yeah, they put, they put Asterion in Lysel's, and Lysel's wearing Asterion's. This is, this is the, the progress we've made today. Can I, can I, can I see you? Yeah, um, they're voting on multi-class, so in a minute you can. Okay. Uh, I gotta take out, uh, Fighter here and replace it with Rogue. 
But I think they're going to make her a bard, which is really funny. Uh, okay. Uh, Multi-class, group A, and then we'll do group B because the, the poll can't be that big. So you can vote bard, vote barbarian, vote druid, vote monk, vote paladin, or vote rogue. <clears throat> She, she is. She's, cause it, it, yeah, she's like, make me a barbarian, which would be really funny. <clears throat> show her what, I will show her what you guys did to Asterion. Somebody said, hello, Dispenser. Dispenser, that is my name. <laughs> Hexblade? I wish Hexblade was a thing in this game. That'd be cool. Um, it, <laughs> 178 votes for Bard? Y'all are silly. A tangerine? Mm-hmm. Okay, there were like a billion votes for a bard. It was like 170 something. All right, vote for group B, which is a uh, ranger, sorcerer, warlock, wizard, or cleric. Or you can abstain if you really want bard. <laughs> There's a seed in it. Can you give me a straw? Whoa, he's throwing, he's just throwing stuff. Wizard's got like 20 votes, but like everybody's abstaining just so that she can be barred. <laughs> oh, it is so funny to just watch you guys just put your entire brain together. It is the, it is, it is, I live for it. All right, Lizelle, congratulations on your new ex expertise of being a bard. Cause uh, I don't, I don't. Unless Wizard gets a lot of votes, if everybody gets really cool about <laughs> Wizard in about two seconds, <laughs> just not gonna happen. She's going Bard. Uh, oh god, we gotta choose our cantrips and our spells. Um, okay, D uh, vote one if you want to choose our spells. Vote two if you just want to go with default. <clears throat> Death Metal Lizelle. I I know that that. Uh, she would. Bribe for Spencer to play for two minutes. Steal all the shinies and gold like a little goblin. Leave. Refuses to elaborate. She would. That's... Uh, when I watch her play Baldur's Gate 3, she, like, I'll be like, oh, you should go over there and look at that thing. And... <laughs> She will click on everything along the way. She will Chat just is the loot. Absolute mind, it seems. <laughs> just loot everything in sight. Chat is the absolute. Yeah, you know what? Chat kind of is the absolute. The, the absolute number two, the better absolute. So was was two two was two was uh, default, right? One was pick, two was default. I think that's that's what I said. Um, okay, we'll we'll leave her with default, uh, which is fine. Oh, we should vote on our instrument though. Let's do that. Okay, so vote one if you wanted to have a drum. Vote two if you wanted to have a flute. Vote three if you wanted to have a lute. Vote four for a lyre. Or vote uh, five for a violin. <clears throat> you can, oh, you can hear him too. Do, 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 do. The drum is kind of funny, but I feel like you guys are gonna go flute. That's my guess. A drum, drum is in the lead. That's surprise. That's that's great. I think drum is real funny. Bribe to push a starion off a cliff. Guys, hey. why do we? <laughs> I can hear you. <laughs> if you want to mic yourself, you can. Uh... No. All right, no worries. Push a star. <sighs> That's gonna be a bigger bribe. A bigger bribe, uh, <laughs> guys. We uh, we've already decided whether to kill a starion or not. I I appreciate the bribes. But we vote way too much on whether Asterion should die. You guys have to have a Asterion death cooldown. Okay, so she's got a drum. Um, and I guess she's taking deception. Cool. Alright, look at it look at Asterion, Spencer. Look at him. Hello. <laughs> what can I do for you? Spencer. Oh. <laughs> His cheeks are out! Wants to tell. <laughs> I'm a magistrate back in the city. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to choose dialogue options. I was just trying to see more of Asterion. Um, okay, so... Uh, do you... Gale also? Uh, we don't even have Gale. Oh, she's... It's... Look, she's got the drum on her! <laughs> but Shadowheart gets to be purple? Oh, 
I guess so. Shadowheart does get to keep her clothes. All right, uh, play us a little song, uh, Lizelle. Play, play Bard Dance. Oops. Okay. Good stuff, Lizelle. You're you're fantastic bard. No she's she's either. perfect. Uh, okay, so we can either go um we'll we'll frame it like this. This is left, and if we go this way, you know, we'll decide again, and then there's more stuff that way. Or we can go right. That this direction is right. There's like something over here. I don't I don't I, I know what it is, but you guys don't know what it is. So vote. Right or left from this point. That's, this is left, this is right. <clears throat> Here's what we'll do. If you guys, if, if Asterion does something, you know, I think I think Narf Narf needs to have a reason to kill Asterion. So if we're look, thinking in the mind of Narf Narf, the Mud Chicken Usurper, if she, uh, if Asterion does something, acts up, goes unconscious, then we'll vote to see if Asterion should be thrown off a cliff or not. Um, which w that 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 will be our our main deciding factor. So we'll go right. Bribe to recruit Minthra. Minthara. If you guys manage to get Minthara, I will be very surprised. That would be that would be very uh, funny. You, not another step. Hear me? Oh. Boss, got company up here. Uh oh. What's this then? Trying to creep around us and loot the crypt? <laughs> Oops. Maybe we should have stealthed. Happening. Or is it Short the kings, ship yeah. you're after? Romance Don't Minthara? Right you guys have to do a lot to get Minthara. Eat him alive? Kill? Goodness. All right. Your dialogue options here are Good number idea, one. Spencer. Bribe to take Shadow Hearts clothes. Uh, okay, we'll we'll do that after this. Uh, number one, I mean no harm. I'm just looking around. Number two is a persuasion check. Number three is a deception check. Number four is an intimidation check. Number five is a monk insight check. Uh, and number six is attack. <laughs> just just kill. <laughs> this guy this guy had a bit of a mean tone. Narf Narf doesn't stand for tone. You will respect Narf Narf upon meeting her. Look at the people she carries behind her. <laughs> they have no clothes. <laughs> They're going to be using fists. They don't even have weapons. It's really close between five and six. That's really surprising. Right to multi-class everyone into Bard at the next opportunity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, chat, you heard it. Everybody really wants to go Bard, which is pretty funny. Um, okay, so I think winner was six by two votes. That's crazy. Attack! <laughs> Um, okay, because there was a bribe for it, I suppose, uh, uh, vote one right now if you, if we're gonna spend the first turn of combat also taking off, uh, Shadowheart's clothes, or vote two if, no, don't do that, we love Shadowheart and don't want anything to happen to her, and she also wasn't mean to us, so that's weird, but vote number one if, yes, everybody has to be naked. <laughs> Bribe to get Minthra cause I have no idea who they are. Uh, Minthara's a hot drow lady, but you have to be evil in order to get her. And, I mean, who knows? Maybe chat will just go full 180 with the character direction of, of Narf Narf. <clears throat> um, she's a little bit later, but, you know, maybe we'll get to her. We'll see. I don't think we will. So, two, we are, we, we, we're going to keep Shadowheart in her armor. Sounds great. Good, good stuff. Um, are we killing these guys? Can you vote? Guys, vote one for, for if we're going to kill them. Vote two if we're going to leave them unconscious. As I can turn on the, the non-lethal and, and we'll, we'll knock them unconscious. But uh, uh, vote, vote one if, if they deserve the death penalty. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I I got to Minthara in the early access, and I think you have to, I think you have to like uh, go to the goblin camp, side with them, and then agree to take down the druids, and then like kill all the druids, and then Minthara's like, you're great. And as far as I know, she just sleeps with you. But I think maybe in the full game she could become a companion, which would be pretty crazy. Um, okay, we're gonna kill him. We're gonna we're gonna kill him. You know, uh, uh, Asterian, you are first, but Narf Narf goes first always uh, before you, Asterian, because uh, Narf Narf has to establish dominance. Um, and oh, we got so many abilities now. We have step of the wind, disengage, patient defense, and dash, which is great. Um, this guy right here was acting up, so we are going to make sure the non-lethal attacks are off and uh, punch the absolute shit out of this guy. Seven damage. Come on, Narf Narf. <clears throat> Uh, okay, uh, guys, nobody's healed, because <laughs> we killed them. <laughs> it's, it is... <laughs> what is a steering going to do? <laughs> Shove, I guess. Oh! That worked. That was great. Good job, Asterian. Um, okay, chicken, chicken the bird needs to go next. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna fly. We'll just fly here. And then... Beak this guy. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Uh, Lizelle, use your fists to... Oh, she has bard spells now. All right. Dude. Dude. She has vicious mockery. We can hear... I want to hear what her vicious mockery is. This is really funny. Let my name be known. <laughs> that is so awesome that they recorded lines for her to have vicious mockery. <laughs> That's so great. <laughs> she actually says stuff. That is so funny. Oh, okay. Um, play your drum. <laughs> no, no. <let's laughs> Whoa. He stopped. He stopped Lizelle's beautiful performance. How could they do that? All right. Um, do we have any cool ranger stuff for, for, we have Find Familiar, which we've already cast. What, what, what are we getting for Shadowheart being a ranger? Uh, protection from evil and good and Find Familiar. Great. Um, do, I don't know if we're getting anything else, but we will, uh, I guess attack this guy. Give him, give him a little in canvas. That didn't, that, that didn't, that didn't pan out. It's okay. Gimbal Bok, you... He went for a stare. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, no, that's not good. Went straight to sleep. Um, okay. So... Oh, I forgot we're playing on Tactician, y'all. We got a quick save. Okay. Uh, Vlacketh does not take kindly to those who would be interrupt- Who'd interrupt the sounds of the Githyanki war drum. I know, right? Okay, oh, Gimbalbach is uh, not Gimbalbach. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, Narf Narf is not asleep. The bird and Lizelle are asleep. <laughs> That's really funny. He's Eldritch Blast. I don't even know if he can use sneak attack. <laughs> He's not, he doesn't even have the ability to be a rogue. Y'all got any suggestions on, on what we should, <laughs> what we should do with this Darien here? Hex unarmed strike? Alright, we'll hex him for, for strength. And then we'll do an unarmed strike. <laughs> cool. Uh, Narf Narf, get Gimbalbach. He disrespected you. Why can't we do two? Oh, there it is. Oh, okay, missed. Hex, hex Wisdom for Bard Spells? Oh, that's true. <laughs> But it's not saving throws, it's ability checks, because Hex is a really good Man, spell. I've followed you for years, and landing on this stream right as I get home from vacation, oh. craving some BG3 is as great as its unexpected doc Hell yeah. Cheers. Thank you so much, appreciate it. It's awesome. Yeah, this game is a lot of fun. Uh, the, we all in the TTRPG community have, like, I feel like, united behind it, which is which is great. Community really coming together here. Um, Shadowheart... I don't even know. Maybe heal Lizel? Uh, shove attacks? Okay. Heal? Okay, we'll, we'll heal. Heal Lizel. Okay, good job, Asterion. Even though you're wearing, like, absolutely nothing, still missed. Oh! 
Oh no, did chicken die? They killed chicken! They killed chicken! Asterion is not doing great with these unarmed strikes. Um, that, you, you will, you will regret this. Oh no. Oh no. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Do we have enough movement? Yep. Come here, you. How dare you attack my chicken? How dare you kill chicken? Okay, um, maybe we should do a Tasha's Hideous Laughter. Uh, let's do Second Wind, because Lazelle's getting pretty low. Avenge chicken. Yeah, 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 yeah. We will 100% avenge them as soon as we're not dying. Uh, Dissonant Whispers is also good. I feel like th this, with this mage is acting up, but it's only a 25% chance. We're going to try it. There we go. That's awesome. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Did somebody in the chat just ask why they're all naked? I don't know. Ask the chat. <laughs> they, they decided this. <laughs> Everybody's naked because because that's what everybody wanted. Um, okay, we let's heal. Uh, let's let's give a little cure uh, healing word to Narf Narf. Did, wait, did they just kill? Where did the acid come from? Did they kill their own person? I didn't even notice that. Oh no, her mind collapsed. Never mind. La Lazelle, she took more damage on her turn. I see, I see. Okay. I thought I thought they I thought the, the acid killed her. Um, okay, then let's do uh let's let's just do a hit on, on Gimbal Box. Okay. Asteria, no! You got any loot? Take. Okay. Uh we gotta we gotta take care of Gimbal Box. He's being real annoying. Let's take a little potion of healing, and you then punch the him. Fight, friend. Yes, you're so strong, Narf Narf. Um, let's let's do dissonant whispers again. That worked out. Yes, perfect. Lysel being barred was was a good choice. Vote to let Asterian die. Yeah, he did go down, so I will, will let you guys vote on whether he's failed you too much now, and we won't bring him back. Uh, I, I'm not going to bring him up right now, it's kind of a waste of a turn. I think I just want to take care of these guys, so let's do a concussive smash on on this dude. So he's kind of being a problem. Cool. Um, and then that's all Shadowheart can do. Oh, they're killing him! Okay, now I am going to vote now, because there, he could potentially die, so... Uh, vote one if you want to save Asterion. Vote two if you just want to let him die. It's a real divisive issue in in the in the mind of Narf Narf. She can't. She has no idea whether or not she could. She should keep Asterion alive. It's a uh, something she she <laughs> argues in her mind throughout the day. I was gonna say throughout her life, but it's it's only been like one day. <laughs> He's already dead. Did I say vote one if we're gonna if we're gonna get him back up? I don't remember what I said. Hey guys, my short term memory, I'm actually a goldfish. Number one is save him. Vote one to revive. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Vote one is revive. Um <laughs> we'll Oh he's dead, dead! <laughs> he's killed. He's he's very dead. <laughs> oh, oh no! Well, everybody said revive him, so we'll we'll get him back. We'll get him back up. The stereo. Oh, we'll do it after the combat. Now he's dead. There's. Uh, I mean, it's almost not worth it. He was he was <laughs> not doing well. Okay, gotta get gimbal block again, dude. Please. There we go, there we go. Okay. Uh Lizel, maybe you can get him back up. Yeah. Let's 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 do that. Listerian, you get another chance. The chat really hates you, but um they seemingly vote to keep you alive. So there's a very strong silent majority that that loves you. <laughs> oh no. 
This is going really well, guys. Um, okay. Let's see. Uh, we really need to take care of one of these guys. We gotta focus Gimbalbach down. Oh my goodness, this is not going well. A rush attack! Oh boy. Oh boy. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Um, we, we just have to, we just have to kill. We can't spend more time on these guys. We have to kill. There we go. Come on, bring him down. Bring him down, bring him down! Loot, everything. Okay, okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Throw a heal? I, it, it, it takes an action. We need to use our action to, to, to... Oh, God. Oh, no. Okay. We'll vote now. Vote, okay, I'm gonna remember this time. I'm gonna remember this time. Vote one, vote one, if Shadowheart's gonna, gonna get up one of them. Uh, uh, vote two, if we just kill. Vote, that, that's, I'm just, I'm just directing the strategy. The strategy of the comment here. Are we voting one to save them? We're voting two to kill. And revive later, maybe, if we vote on it. Because, uh, just to remind everybody who maybe wasn't here for the beginning of the last stream, we're on Tactician. We're on the hardest difficulty. This is, uh, going really well so far. Uh, uh, this is really close. This is really, really, really close. Alright, looks like we're gonna spend our turn getting them back up. Um, so Shadow Heart, I th can you throw a potion and I have it hit both? That might be an option. I don't know if that works, but we will, we will, we will test some stuff out. <laughs> it just gave it to neither of them. Uh, I failed you, Master Wine. I failed you. Um, all right. Well, well, hopefully they don't die, and we'll get get one of them up next turn. Okay, Lysel is dead. <laughs> so we will we'll follow the orders of the chat. We'll get Asterion up. Is this a bonus action? It is an action to use Scroll of Vivify, and then we'll just shove this dude. We can at least get some. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, Asterion, drink a potion. No, 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 no. No, 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 no! Oh, yikes! Narf, narf got shoved. Uh, okay. So, um, vote one to revive Lizel with one of our scrolls. Vote two to keep fighting Bright and to do lower damage. The difficulty to balance. Bright to lower the difficulty. Okay, after this combat, we'll we'll take another vote. <laughs> On, on uh, lowering the difficulty. Put that one on the stack. Okay. Yeah, vote two if you just want to keep fighting. Vote one if you want to revive Lizel. Because this combat's uh, going going quite a uh, direction. I, I thought this would be easy. I thought we'd just kill these guys and be done, but... Ugh. Three for potion throwing? <laughs> She's dead. The potion throwing isn't going to work. <laughs> Give Asterian weapons? You, th this was your choice. This was your... <laughs> you guys are experiencing consequences. Okay, we're just going to keep fighting. Uh, so we could potentially do 2 to 7 damage. Sacred Flame does 1 to 8. 60% or 55%. It's just better to do Sacred Flame. Okay, 4. That's good. It's not bad. Uh, Asterian? The chat is now realizing that maybe we should have give, give, given you weapons. Um, but 45% chance to punch? Wow! Look at that one damage! Nothing important is ever easy. Okay, we can take care of this guy, I think, which is which is good. Um, so let's do a little... Let's do a little well, I want to get two attacks. We won't make it, though, so we're, we're going to have to jump. And then run. And then get one punch. Seven damage. God, Narf Narf is... So strong. Oh, good. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Uh, Shadow Heart's kind of tanking. Cool. 
That didn't that didn't work. Let's try shove. Okay, that didn't work either. Asterion, punch. Good, good job, buddy. Good job. You won damage. You're so good. Oh, oh, he shoved. That wasn't bad. I can't even catch my breath. Narf, narf, punch. Narf, narf, punch again. Hell yeah. Loot the Bribe entire to body. The way to increase difficulty. <laughs> Bribe to, to to increase it. It's already pretty. It's at the highest difficulty possible, and you guys have made it even harder by making by multi-classing into strange, terrible classes, and by making all the companions naked. So this is, I think, the hardest the game can be. <laughs> Nobody gets wet. Is it Karmic Dice? Karmic Dice is off. Karmic Dice is 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 off. Yeah, look at it. It, the karmic dice is off. This is the hardest the game can be. And we still and we still won. Still won that fight. And, and, and Steren's getting entangled. All right. Uh, take all this. Now we're encumbered, so we're gonna have to figure out what to do with all of our stuff. Okay, um, vote one to revive Lizelle, vote two to keep her dead, and then we're gonna vote on the potential difficulty change. But it seems like everybody's happy with keeping it on Tactician. I'm done. I can't wait to sleep. I do a little quick save. There's so much blood. <laughs> it's everywhere. Bribe to multi-class Astarian into Monk next level up. <laughs> I, 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 with the amount of bribes and the amount of how much Chad has been doing it, I don't think we will get away from Ed, all of them just being one level in every class. Okay, so we are reviving Lizel. We're, we're, we, one has one, so, so we are reviving her. Yeah, like absurd. We're not. <laughs> uh, okay. So so we so we we will we will revive Lizelle. Why aren't we using Firebolt? You could switch it to a different language for fun, perhaps German. Yeah, for fun. That sounds like a ton of fun to just not understand the game. <laughs> even harder, make the game even more difficult. Um, okay, so we, we revive Lizelle, and uh, now we're... Okay, we, we have a lot of vote options here. So, uh, first thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to vote on changing difficulty. So, let me just get that one ready. I'm going to have all of them on there. Wait, uh... What, what is it? What is it? Uh, uh, what are the different difficulty types? Explorer, Balanced, or Tactician? Uh, you guys just really have to spell that one. You know, I'm just going to do one, two, and three. Uh, uh, Explorer will be one. Balanced is two. Tactician is three. So we are currently already on Tactician, but there were a lot of people and some bribes in the chat of potentially changing this. So, um, go ahead and vote on that. And then we will... Vote on whether or not to give them weapons, and then uh, we we will choose our direction because oh we we we're we're getting very sidetracked on <laughs> on various things. You can vote one for explorer, vote two for balanced, or vote three for tactician. We are currently on tactician, which is fine. It's just really difficult, and people are going to die a lot. Um, but if you guys want to be silly and goofy, it's going to be a better time if we're, on, if we're on balanced, but I don't mind either way or even explore. If you guys want to go easy mode and Bribe just to have chat vote to start from character creation, every party one. Wow. 
This may sound like a meme, but this is in case we get stuck in an absolutely unwinnable situation. Okay. Um, so that is something we, I, I was planning. That's, that's a, what, what a wonderful suggestion bribe, I suppose, from Havoc 13. I think what we'll do is if we TPK, um, I, I was, I was thinking about doing this anyways. When we TPK, I will ask the chat, be like, do we restart the whole game or do we just try the combat again? Um, but we will make very little progress if we restart every TPK. Okay, we're going to move to balanced. Interesting. Uh, so we're going to... This is exactly what I did in my playthrough. I was like, tactician sounds fun. Uh-oh, it's hard. Uh, the poll's still on the screen. Let me fix that. I still think it's active? There we go. Okay, uh, so we will switch to balanced. Sounds good. Okay. Vote one if you want to give everybody weapons. Vote two if you don't want to do that. And I know we could really scrutinize here and be like, no, Asterion gets weapons, but Lysel doesn't. It's going to take too much time. Weapons, yes or no? <laughs> seems, it seems like yes. It seems like keep clothes off, give them weapons. <laughs> I'm not going to give the monk weapons. Shadow Heart already has a weapon too. Yeah, I, I, I won't give Narf Narf any weapons. Cool. Um, one now vote again. You can vote one. So we've got we've got we've got some weapons here. Um, let's let's go into our inventory. Uh, I think we want to give us a, 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 a Asterian this dagger. I think we also want to give him a short bow. And then, um... Scimitar? Is it light in finesse? Yeah, we'll also give him a scimitar. So he can dual wield. Uh, do we have a crossbow? He's... Oh, he's not proficient in scimitars, says Spencer right now. We also found a shovel. That's nice. Um, and then, okay. So we could give Lysel a sword. Uh, or we could give her the, the birthmite. Um, so vote one if you want to give her a regular sword. Vote two if you want to give her the, the birthmite. The Everburn blade. Which currently none of us can use. <laughs> it's, a, it's a pretty pretty dang good sword. It would it would it would be bad to go to waste. <laughs> I mean, we can use it just not effectively. Yeah, I know we could use it, and it would just be terrible. Um, but Chad already voted for us not to use it last last time, so we we have to we have to stick with what we're doing. All right, cool. Looks like we are giving that to Lizel, which. I think is a good option. If if you know if I'm to to have an opinion. There you go, Lizel. Wow, great. Oh, okay. So I think Lizel is in her armor. Why does it say? What is? What? What? What is happening? No, what? Oh, the game... The ga I th Did the game bug? I know, she's not wearing it, but I just... Oh, because it was in Narf Narf's inventory. No time to rest. Now it's not in her inventory. Okay, I see, I see. So, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just take that back from you, Lizel. Thanks. That's that's ours. That's that's for us. Not for you. Infinite armor glitch. Yeah, that's what I thought was happening for a second. Um, okay, we've looted all these bodies. Are we still encumbered? We are. All right, we got to do something about that. I'm gonna go by weight here. Maybe Lizelle should carry her armor so we're not uh, encumbered. Um, and we'll also put this scale mail on. Is anybody proficient in this scale mail? Let's see. Hmm. Is Shadowheart proficient in it? Shadowheart's proficient in it, but her AC is already pretty good. So, um, drink an elixir of strength. Yeah, that won't last for forever. Uh, we're just gonna have to offload a little bit. Okay, we've, we, now we've got a lot more we can carry. All right, there we go. We still have Asterian's clothes on us. You know, we're, we're still, we're still, we've got these brains on us. <laughs> Send to camp? Okay. Send to camp. Sounds good. Send to camp. 
send to camp. Uh, and what about these mines? Do you guys want to send those to camp? Yeah, you could. You guys could totally just give her her armor and make her appear in her camp clothes. Um, yes, no, yes. Send everything we can to camp. You guys want to keep most of this? Yeah. Okay, we're we're putting these in camp because I know you guys want more loot than this. Uh, and we'll also put these these leather armors to camp. There. Look at all that inventory space that we have now. All right, we're gonna continue moving forward. Mm. Okay, so we've, we, we're, we're now here. We've got two options. We can go down this hole. We can, we can destroy this thing and go down this hole. Uh, or we can go in through this door. Or we can leave. So up to you guys. Vote one if you want to go through this door. Vote two if you want to go through in through the secret hole entrance. And vote three if you want to leave. One for door. Two for hole. <laughs> three for... Three for leaving. <laughs> yeah, um, a vote for a hole. Of course, the hole is the optimal entrance. <laughs> the secret back door hole entrance. That's that's the uh, that's that's the way to go. Chad wants all. What about the other entrance? No, 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 there isn't one. Don't don't worry about it. This 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 is our this is our direction forward. Look, I know there's lots of options in this game, but think of me as your dungeon master, and I'm giving them your current options right now. That's what that's what's currently happening. Where's Asterion? Oh, he's I, he was blending in. I couldn't see him. Uh, Asterion, why do you still have no weapons? There we go. Okay, I don't think he's a, he's not proficient in the scimitar, so we're just gonna give him a dagger. And do we have another dagger? No, but we'll give him a hand axe, just so he can have two weapons, so he can have that offhand attack. Um, okay. Is he, profi is he proficient in this? Yeah. Okay, everybody's got weapons now. We're also going to give Shadowheart a bow, just in case, even though she's really not going to need it. Um, okay, Asterion, shoot it down. Incredible. Okay, um, vote one for stealth, vote two for no stealth. Narf Narf should put on Asterion's clothes. Okay, she did, and she was not proficient in it and could not use many of her monk abilities, and we voted on it, and everybody said, no, don't wear Asterion's clothes, just keep them. It was funny, though. We revived him while wearing his clothes, and we're just like, uh, yeah, basically, um, this is what's happening to you right now, and uh, you better learn to respect Narf Narf. And I think they are. <laughs> I also got like a fiery sword and a drum. <laughs> uh, do a short rest first. Okay, we'll we'll short rest first. Uh, okay, so we're gonna stealth. Sounds good. Stealth. Let's do a short rest. Just a brief respite. A brief respite. Um, maybe we should do another short rest because some some folks are still missing health. Welcome there we go. Rest. All right, so there we go. I got our strat all figured out. Let's get in the hole. What? Uh, yeah. yeah go ahead. Spencer, Spencer sends me memes. Why is nobody else hiding? Why? Wait. Why was no? Why was Narf Narf the only one who was hiding? I pushed group stealth. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh boy! All right, Narf, Narf, do a do a gigantic punch on uh, on this lady right here while you're hiding. Okay. Uh, once again, um, I need to just have one for this. Lethal or non-lethal? I'm just gonna make this a a ready to go pull. Non-lethal is going to be one. Uh, lethal is going to be uh, two. So, uh, vote for that right now. 
Which we'll we'll just we'll just pull that at the beginning of most combats. Just so I get a sense of direction on where we're going with that. <clears throat> they all got seen. Oh, nobody else was was stealthing good enough. <laughs> Narf Narf was the only one. That makes sense. They just got detected. Okay, okay, I see. They just got caught immediately. <laughs> Eat the bandits? Yeah, uh... Come on, Larian. Where's my Fallout cannibal perk? Why can't I eat the people that I kill? We just go full insanity. Non-lethal is not the default. It's just the first one. Uh, yeah, just surprise me. All right, we're going lethal. We are killing these guys. Sounds great. I I love killing bandits. Hungry for the soup, sir. Uh, Asterian now can do sneak attack. Um, but he's got hex now too, so let's uh, let's do a little let's do a little uh, wisdom. Well, okay, it's not saving throws. We should actually do like strength, so that they can get pushed. And then we will do a sneak attack. Dead. Wow, I love playing on not tactician. I mean, I, actually, I don't know. Tactician is really fun, but uh, we we will be succeeding a lot more here. Okay, Lizel, do you have a firebolt that can go over here? I don't think so. Do we have any alchemist alchemist fires? I don't think we do. Does not look like it. So, all right, hang on. I gotta reset my overlay real quick because it's hard to see some stats with the chat in the way. Uh, boop. Put that right there. There we go. That's much better. Um. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna put chat in the other corner. It's actually much better over there. Yeah, over here. That's that's great. What? Every, wants to talk to me. Uh, every single person? Not everyone, but looking for Oh, you just did some crazy stuff in your game, huh? I did. Yeah, yeah. Red barrel. Yeah, I know. Lizelle could attack it with the Everburn blade, but then she'll die, and I think that's not a great idea. Um, she doesn't really have fire. I don't think we have any um any 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 fire, so we may just have to wait for Shadow Heart, because this guy will go next. So, um, for now, Lysel, Vicious Mockery, this guy, or this guy. An ode for you. Odeur, mayhaps. Odeur, mayhaps. Throw the sword? That would have, I didn't even think about that. That would have been a great idea. Um, okay, I don't think I want Narf Narf to get in here because it's going to explode. So let's just shut the door. <laughs> Uh, and then, um, yeah, yeah, that'll be fine. And then Shadowheart can run up and do a, do, do a firebolt. <laughs> that guy opened the door for us. It's fine. Okay. Hopefully that guy just isn't in the way. Yeah, there we go. We got this. Great job. Ah, flawless plan. You thought you could hit us? Fool. We have the power of Narf Narf. And the Birthmite. And Asterion's naked ass. Perish. Oh, okay. Or offhand attack. Okay. G good enough. Okay, Liza, you need to, like, jump through some people here. Um, can't you do that? Uh, can we jump? Can we jump there? Yeah, nice. Kill. Oh, the power of the birthmite. What a what a great weapon that we'll take to the very end of the game. Okay, Narf Narf, you need a potion healing. Uh, and then you need to move. But I, I don't think there's any room because Lysel's in the way. Um. Ooh. I don't really want her to. Do, she just. She did take some fire damage. She should be fine. There's just not enough room here. Do we not have bonus? Oh, we used the bonus action. Oops! Let's throw a sword! Maybe I should. No, this is good. <laughs> One damage! In Candace. Oops. Well. Um. Okay. Asterion. You gotta jump in here. 
because Lysel's still in. I could have just moved Lysel. That was dumb. That was that was silly. You know what, Lysel, get up here so that Asterian can get sneak attack. Can you feel death's cold grip? There we go. Okay. We're great. And these things have stayed interesting. Take everything. All right. I think we're gonna stop taking armor. I think uh, I think that's a bit redundant. We have so much armor. So we are just going to take the necessities, like poison and thieves tools, and another dagger for Asterion. And these javelins for Narf Narf. And these, and this drippy, these drippy gloves. I don't think we need the great club. Narf Narf needs everything. We're going to be encumbered and sent- You can't defeat us. We have the power of Narf Narf, and the birthright, and Asterion's naked ass. <laughs> Jacob 2023. Yep. You can quote that. Yeah, uh, that's that's uh, that's the that's the experience of, of this game right now. Is that? All right, Asterion, take another dagger. There we go. Okay. Um. So. Uh. <laughs> quite some. We have some options here. Um. We can't go through this door, but we can go into this room, and then we uh can also go in through this door. So that's gonna be that's gonna be our our vote here. Is left or right, or right or or left, um, and hello. Are you gonna you gonna work? Pull. There we go. Um, so if you guys want to go right, we'll go this way through this door. If you guys want to go left, we'll go through this door. Layer up in armor, money. We did take the money, but yeah, I know selling all of it is gonna be really beneficial. But then we're gonna have to go to camp. Okay, you know, fine, 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 fine. I will take the I will take everything, but I'm gonna send the armor to camp so that we can sell it later. That that that's that's a I think that that's a great idea. Send to camp. Send to camp. Send Asterion's armor to camp. Send the shield to camp. Um, and we have so many weapons. <laughs> We should send these robes to camp. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, so we're gonna go left. That's what it's looking like here. We bullied Jacob into commerce. I know, you guys want as much gold as possible. I mean, I guess I guess it's fair. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go left. Do we loot you? Nope. Gotta send that to camp as well. And this bow. Okay. Put the bed in our backpack. Okay, let's, uh, first things first, loot everything in the room, because that's what chat wants to do. Ooh, books. Uh, ooh, another book. What's in here? Mmm, more books. Uh, wow. Picking up lots of books. Uh, chapel records. What does that say? Fine dust coats the pages of this weathered book. Beneath the bone-white powder, hundreds of short obituaries are recorded in tiny script. Grorbian Tipple, Ilmater, Drowning. Yvain Arkinson, Ogma, Internal Rot. Devrin Stout, Saluna, Fever. It's like they're recording their deaths? Where's Chicken? Oh, I'm so sorry. We gotta get Chicken back. Totally forgot about Chicken. Okay, I'm gonna walk over here. Oh. Whoa! A lever! Vote one if you want to pull the lever. Vote two if you don't want to do that. We'll take this gold and this quill and this ink pot. And while I'm while we're voting on that, uh, I'll continue looting. Like this book called The Unclaimed that we already have, but because we want as much gold as humanly possible, we, we're going to take everything. Which you may prove to be... You know, worth it in the long run. There will be some powerful magic item that, that we're going to want to take. And uh, we'll be able to sell this library of books in order to obtain them. Alright, looks like we're going to pull the lever. I wonder what that did. What that did. Weird. Alright, this room is completely void. Now we got to get this plate and bowl. Um, okay. So, uh, oh, it opened this door right here. Well, the, now there's a new way to go, everybody. Uh, so, 
uh, we're gonna we're gonna vote right or left again. This is left. This door that we just opened is left, and then uh, this way is right, because uh, the those are two directions that we can go. Cardinal directions of right just and left. Here has Jacob Dog piled on a stallion <laughs> more with Me? absolutely no outside interference. <laughs> Also bribed to turn a starion into a druid, where he must stay as a raven henceforth named Lil Chicken. Lil Chicken? Yeah, um, yes, I have continued to dogpile on a starion by giving him the, the sexiest outfit in the game. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, with the amount of bribes coming in on the various classes that everybody wants everybody to go in, um, we... <laughs> It's gonna be some strange multi-class options. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go left. Is there anything in here that we can loot? Nope, there's just candles. Alright, we are now in the dank crypt. And there's treasure chests everywhere. We have, to, we have to take it all. Loot everything. We we, we have money to make. All right. Once we find a merchant, they're gonna they're gonna have an entire dungeon in their pockets. Ooh, a torch. Take it. No traps, please. Scroll of protection of evil and good. Fantastic. What do we got? A jug here? Yep. I'll take the jug. Can I take the vase? Nope. Perfect. Okay. Once again, we got big nor big. <laughs> Open the nor. <laughs> I said big nor. We got a big door. And then, another big door. So, we can go left. This one's going to be left. And this one's going to be right. Vote. Hmm. Can we take the floor? Yeah, you know, if the floor was able to be added to our inventory, we definitely do it. This, this, we definitely would. This pillar? We'd add that pillar into our inventory if we could. we got to make as much money as possible. You know, if, if, if we are making money, then what are we doing? What, what are the items in the game for, if not their gold cost? See this shirt? It's 11 gold pieces. See this book? F 42 gold pieces. That's actually super good. T ink? This ink pot? 10 gold. This plate? 3 gold. I don't, I don't even see items. Chat? Chat? Night? We don't even see items. We just see gold. Free money lying around. We're a little... We're a little... We're a little... <laughs> divisive on whether we go right or left here. Layer up in armor. Um, oh, there are some people asking if the VOD will be available. The VOD will will be up on the channel. Yeah, I don't. I'm not putting the VOD anywhere. It'll stay on the channel. Um, okay, so we're gonna go left. That sounds good because that that there's definitely nothing um, bad in that room at all. Well, it's locked. Starian. Lo okay, guys. Vote one if you want to break the door down. Vote two for lock picking it. Vote one for smashing the door down with the birthmite, or or vote two for for lock picking it. <laughs> it's really funny that you guys have this very strange complex with the NPCs, but the second we get into the story of the game, we're delving in a dungeon. Like, we're just on top of it. We're just going in the right direction. You know, we're we're exploring, we're looting, we're killing the people in our way, and we're going exactly where we need to be. But Narf Narf breaks down doors. <laughs> Can I do it with her fists? Oh That'd be fun. Oh no. Come on, Narf Narf. It has medium toughness. That that means that you have to do like more than twenty-two damage. Can can the birthmite do twenty-two damage? The birthmite can't even do twenty-two damage. Okay, we gotta get creative. How can we do twenty-two damage? We've got acid. That does twelve damage. Is it is it resistant to anything? It's resistant to fire slashing. It is resistant to piercing. Um Psychic, Poison, Radiant, and Force. Oh, Force damage Hi, against this viewers. entity is doubled. I wonder how many pots this journey will go. Hopefully a lot. I, I, I think this has been a lot of fun, and I, I want to see how far we can get in this game. This journey has been incredible. Um, okay, so slashing damage is vulnerable to slashing, so let's, let's try... 
Come on. Ooh, there we go. Yes! Birthmite! Okay. Let's head into this room. Whoa. Got some guys. No sign of a struggle. So we've got quite a few directions we can go here. Um, there's some undead guys on the floor. A scroll of burning hands of gold. It's crazy. Okay, so we've got a door here. Um, we've got a way to go forward, which is, you know, over here. Uh, it's strange. Um, or we've got a direction to go right as well, which uh, may lead to an exit. So uh, I guess I'll make a new poll that'll be like... I'll just add on to the right or left, and I'll just make one that's option three, which is forward. Which will be button. Oh, I put vote three. Hang on. Forward, I will make it vote forward. There we go. So, once again, just to relay out your choices here, we got left. This is right, and uh, this is forward. Is is this way? There's a there's a button over there. This is sort of our three primary directions that we can go. <laughs> I know the early access area. I know Act One really really well to where I'll be able to sort of foresee what could what could happen, because apparently there are some of you who've never played this game before, and this is the way that you're experiencing it, which is frankly very interesting. But uh, from what I've seen in the chat, the way you guys are voting seems like seems like we kind of know what we're doing here. But uh, uh, once we if if we get to Act Two, we'll kind of be in the dark a little bit because I am I am at Act Three in my main playthrough, and there just may be some things that uh, I don't know what will happen. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna go forward. Jurgle. Jurgle. Scribe, scribe of the dead. Jurgle. Hmm. It's an old god. Okay, guys, there's a button. Do we push it? We're not even going to vote. I'm just going to look at the chat. Do we push the button? Yes? There's a yes and a no. Hell no? There's a lot of yeses. Steal the button? We can't. Okay, there's a lot of yes. We'll push the button. We, we always push buttons. That's that's Narf Narf's M.O. Is button pushing. Narf Narf! You made the dead come back to life in an ancient crypt. Hell, by pushing a button. Just woke up down here. Um. <laughs> are we gonna non-lethal the skeleton? The darkness can be to our advantage. <laughs> I, I don't even know if you can do that. <laughs> Got, we're gonna non-lethal the skeletons. <laughs> They're already dead. <laughs> uh, what is non-lethal even gonna do? Keep them skeletons? What, we don't want to. We don't want to. What is dead may never die. I don't. I don't want to kill the undead. That would be rude. <laughs> they just need some food. They're hungry. <laughs> they were woken alive by a button push in a in a crypt to jurgle. Keep the bones together. All right. Well, well, the poor skeletons. You know they they didn't know. They they don't know any better. We we gotta we gotta non lethal the the skeletons. Of course. All right. Narf Narf always goes first. Um. I don't know. Okay. Well, everybody's in Narf Narf's way. So actually, this time Asterion gets to go first and move. But Narf Narf actually goes first. Wonder if the gods are watching me. And I think we should do a step of the wind dash. And non-lethal these guys into their existence. Okay, we can't reach any of them. Ooh. So we are just gonna have to... Well, we could do a really big dash. And I think it here. Yeah, I think that's the play. We'll just use as much movement speed as we can because Narf Narf has hella speed. Um, Asterion is not even level 2 rogue and can't hide as a bonus action. So we'll reapply Hex, uh, and we'll shoot. I don't even know if we can see the tech. Nope. 
Miss. Venture Furt on a quest to resurrect the skeletons. <laughs> Tony deserves better than to rot in some crypt. Tony? Is that one of the names of the skeletons? I guess you're right. We, we, we'll, we'll find a necromancer somewhere so that we can bring them back to life and they can be, they can be our buddies. I don't know why I just used the bow as, as Shadowheart. Should have hit him with the incandus. Uh, chicken. Um, we don't have enough speed to do that. Uh, chicken, you need to join up with, with Narf Narf. Fly over here. Too far? Uh, she, yeah, you got it. Yeah, 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 we're good. Victory awaits. All right. Lizelle with the birth might. And I'll also have to dash. Well, no, let's not do that. Let's just stay about here. I just don't want everybody grouped up that close together. Let's do another dash. And we'll get up here and deal with this one. Eldritch Blast? Yeah, he does have Eldritch Blast. I did forget about that. I'm used to Asterion being a rogue. Team damage and and it it like went and like fell forward. It's really funny. Okay, now we can actually do non-lethal. Is it dead? Guys, I turned the non-lethal on. Why are they dead? Asterion. Asterion. Okay, everybody wants me to do Eldritch Blast. I don't think the Eldritch Blast will kill him. Uh, chicken, chicken got killed again. Chicken, chicken is is constantly getting destroyed. So, um, okay, we got to use melee attacks. Well, <laughs> guys, it's okay. He's asleep. He's asleep. He's asleep. He's unconscious. He's unconscious. He's unconscious. It, it was a melee attack. The 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 non lethal damage is on. Look, look, look. We'll go into the we'll go into the combat thing. Hang on. Uh, was hit for 12 bludgeoning damage. It was a it was a melee attack, and they're vulnerable. It was fell to a lethal blow. It was on. I don't know if they could be uh, non-lethally brought to zero. <laughs> just press the button again and again to bring him back. He's just resting. He's just taking a little sleep. All right. The button will bring him back to life. His bones are all still together. All right. He's fine. He's fine. Took too much damage at once. No, he didn't. It was just, like, 20. 12. 12. 12 is not enough. That's not instant death. Okay. Let's get over here. Narf Narf going to destroy these guys. <laughs> that is so funny. <sighs> okay. We can't make it to that one. But I think we could step of the wind dash, um, but that would be our bonus action, so not worthy at all of these are bonus actions. So we're just gonna wait. Um, Lizel, you're gonna have to do a vicious mockery. Haha. <laughs> Scented to wit. Yeah, they're animate dead, so you know, they can be reanimated. Te so technically, still undead in a sense. Yeah, Monk is awesome. Monk is great. Rip Bony Tony. <laughs> he was already dead. Okay, we gotta help out. Uh, we gotta help out Shadowheart here. Get him, Asterion. Why did you do three necrotic damage? Why did it do that? Quote, quoth? Who's Quoth? Oh no, this was much earlier. Uh, Asterion used, was in silence. Tuned war oh, Hex. Hex, of course. Of course. I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Um, okay, offhand attack. Yeah, nice. He, non lethal! It's non lethal! He's fine! What should I do? On my way. Shadowheart, hit him with the incandus. Okay, Shadowheart can't see. Gosh dang it. Uh, Shadowheart, shoot him with a bow, I guess. Okay, can't do that either. Um, Shadowheart, dash. Good. 
Okay. Um, narf narf. Hope your soul is in good hands. <laughs> so funny! Oh, narf narf is so good. Narf narf is amazing. I am fury. I am death. All right. Lysel, can we hit with the birthmite, please? Great job, everybody. We non-lethally killed all of those skeletons. It's not the non-lethal is on. The but the button is there. <laughs> Hit them with the bow. Yeah, skeletons are are vulnerable to bludgeoning damage. So punching a skeleton is is the is the strat. Uh, ooh, a key. Good, good, good to know. All right, let's go back in that room we were trying to get into. I'm Fury. I am death. A lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. Whoa. I'm gonna loot everything. Hang on. <gasps> A speak with dead amulet. Should we equip this? Guys, vote one if we should equip it, or vote two if we should equip it to somebody else. I'll take that gold. To keep Narf Narf as a monk only and everyone else one level each class. That way Narf Narf can always assert dominance. Yeah, that's that's what it seems like is, is going to happen here. Man, the YouTube chat just exploded. It just, it, it, it just did not uh, want to compute that at all. Hello. There we go. Goodness. It was taking a minute to load. Um, I think we're gonna redo that because the the chat the chat uh, messed up. So let's try that again. Okay, try again. Vote one if we're equipping it. Vote two if we're equipping it on on either Lysel or Shadowheart or Asterion. I like that one person put vote five. Just cause. And two on vote three. What what is what is vote three? <laughs> yeah, it definitely looks like we're putting that on ourselves. <laughs> Why are you guys voting five? <laughs> There's so many other... <laughs> Equip the quarter staff. We already we already decided to equip our, our fists. We can get two attacks with fists too. It's it's been very good. Vote five is leave it? Okay. Well, that did not win. Uh, we will equip it. Haha! -ha. Uh, Alright, let's, let's see what's going on in here. Now we can talk to the companions we kill. You know, you're right, we can't do that. Go talk to Tony. Uh, Alright, we'll, we'll, we'll try to go talk to Tony. Tony the skeleton. Whoa. I've always thought this guy looks like Hugo Weaving. I don't know. He just kind of looks like Hugo Weaving. He's got the grippers out. It's great. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me. Right as always. Right as always. What a curious way to awaken. Yeah, I'm just a little gnome lady. Now... These are I my question <laughs> companions. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? I do not know if Narf Narf should answer this question. <laughs> Attack! Oh, goodness. Okay, um, so you vote one for quite the question. What's the reason for Lysel in the background? In the background, look at Lysel. Uh, quite the question. What's the reason for it is number one. Number two is, so he has spoken. What he are you talking about? Number three is, little spooked by the crawling out of the tomb bit. What are you? Number four, a peaceful undead. Interesting. Why aren't you attacking me? And number five is, attack. <laughs> We're going to fight him? Oh, no. This will have uh, consequences. I believe. This may, uh... Oh boy. This is gonna be interesting. I don't know if we can take this guy on. I don't know if that is something that we can do. Oh boy. 
Narf Narf sees a strange skelly man with no shoes on come out of a crypt. That's weird. Attack! Dull your weapons as you wish. Die! Uh, die! Die! Well struck. Oh, he's complimenting us. Die! Perish! It's not working. Um. Uh. Blizel, use the birth might. It's guys. It's not working. What do we, what do, we do? He's, he's not dying. He, he he run run the pockets. Uh, okay. Uh, Pickpocket. He's nothing. <laughs> he's nothing on him. All right, we've tried to kill him. We tried to take everything he owns, burn him. It didn't work. Nothing. Nothing. Rob him. We can't take his clothes. Magic. Disney whispers. Uh, okay. Uh, Disney. Dis well Lysel. Vicious mockery. Listen here. He saved. This is a waste. Listen here. He's he's tell he's asking if this is a waste of time. Hit the tomb. I've got a long road ahead. It took no damage. Throw him off the mat. Revote. Check his AC. <laughs> Vote to romance him. <laughs> Guys, we can't kill him. Uh, should we talk to him again or leave? Vote one if you want to talk to him again. Vote two if you want to leave. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. There's, he seems immortal and invincible. Uh, this may. This may have. I, I, Narf Narf didn't realize <laughs> he was so different from the other types of skeletons that we try to non-lethally kill. Tony is our skeleton, not this guy, alright? Wh whoever this guy is, he sure isn't Tony. <laughs> it's funnier to panic attack him and run away. Just, what is the worth of a single mortal's life? <laughs> Run! Quick! <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, we'll talk to him. Hast thou finished? <laughs> he's not talking to me. He's talking to you. I'm I'm just the messenger. Okay, I I didn't I didn't I, I did as you asked. Okay, he, now now he's now he's asking if he's finished. Well, okay, we could number one is lower our weapon and apologize. We could say two coward stand and fight me. Number three is can you not be harmed? What magic is this? Number four is a peaceful undead. Interesting. Why aren't you attacking me? Chat, I think, would rather be caught dead than apologize. <laughs> but I don't know. You guys surprised me in the past with with your with your kindness. So we'll see. <laughs> we are gonna apologize. How on? Uh, of course, of course. I'm, I'm very sorry, Skelly man. You know I. Let me let me lower my weapons. Uh, I, I you know I'm sorry I'm sorry. Neither thy outburst nor thy apology is relevant. Okay. We have met, and I know thy face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. <laughs> Didn't answer his question. Farewell. We just tried to kill him and then said, "Oh, sorry." <laughs> All right. Cool. Um, well, I guess we should, um, maybe leave. Oh, let's try to, we, yeah, we, of course, we gotta, we gotta speak with Dead on our, on our best friend and buddy, uh, Tony the Skeleton. Which was this one, right? That's, is that Tony? Or, or which one's Tony? Is it, is it this one? This one's Tony. Everybody said this one was Tony. Tony! Can't target an undead chat. Just can't can't do that. He's he's already dead. Or you can't speak with him. He's already dead. He's undead. I love the new people showing up and being like, what is Asterion wearing? Um, look, I, 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 my hands are clean, okay? I only did as the chat asked. <laughs> okay, we could go, um, right, which is this way, or left, which is that way. So go ahead and vote on that right now 
That way last is... poll showed us that chat is 34% murder hobos. Yeah, solid 34%. Sometimes they become the majority if, if the NPC has angered Narf Narf in some way. But um, this way is, is left. If you want to go, if you want to go that way, that's left. We will always remember. Yeah, I know. There's only one right option. <laughs> Can I light this brazier? What's next? I don't think anybody can because it's too high up and nobody has like a flames. Oh, shadow heart, light that up. Ah, beautiful. Now we can see. Let's move. Uh, we're gonna. Oh, so close. Uh, right one with one one vote. Wow. All right. Well, I guess Withers is already going in there. He's just he's just he's just making sure it's still there. All right, loot everything. Book is far lighter than it should be with Whoa, such a massive lock. Whoa. <laughs> Asterion! God! <laughs> Jeez! He's got blood on his codpiece. <laughs> uh, you could vote one for an arcana check, but two for a strength check to smash it open, or three, we can just leave. Starian's standing right there. He's not even looking at the book. He just got himself in frame. It was just like, I'm here too. Behold. What a strange book. Thanks, guys, for the donations. Thank you, Shea Money, for the 4 dollars I appreciate that. Sorry, I know I'm not looking at every single one. Uh, I, I am paying attention to the game a little bit. <clears throat> A bony Tony's tiny bony. Thank you, laughing philosopher. Okay, we're gonna try to smash this lock open. We have a minus one to strength because we went Dex Monk, but we will take this guidance and um Do you guys wanna take the Bardic Inspiration? Didn't we get a key earlier? I mean, yeah, but I don't think it goes to the book. Yes? Okay, we'll use a Bardic Inspiration. Lizelle's Bardic Inspiration. Oh, that uh, might that might be necessary. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, we do have an inspiration. Do we want to re-roll it? Um. Let me just do a. Let me just do a. Let me just do a yes or no. Do we want to use the inspiration? Hang on. I gotta make it like forty-five seconds. Oh, I accidentally made it multi-class. Hang on. The camera angles in anime are so weird sometimes. <laughs> they really are. Very strange. <laughs> why would they focus on that? It's just right there in the background. Gosh, why'd they, why'd they put him in that outfit, too? Come on, Larian. Gosh, by default? Okay. Uh, there we go. Do you want to use that inspiration? Yes or no? I'm gonna get some water while you guys vote on this. Okay, we're gonna use that inspiration. All right, let's let's come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, nineteen. Jeez, she's Narf Narf is so strong, just punching everything. As the lock opens, a loose page comes with it. Magic pulses from Whoa. the parchment. Okay. What was once script is now an obliterated scrawl. You have a sense these are names, a list. A list? But of what? A list of people we can punch. That's what it is. All right. Vote on that dialogue. And while you're voting on that dialogue, I'm going to go uh, punch the toilet with my pee. 
They use unarmed strikes. All right, what'd you guys choose? A religion check? Okay. Oh, we have to roll again. Okay, uh, let's add that bardic inspiration again. <laughs> Just use everything we've got, because we do not have a good intelligence. Ow, oh, we're fine. We did great. Did I wash my hands? I did, they smell good. We have this, with this rainwater one. It's delicious. We also have a vanilla one over there. I love hand soap. Gods. Gods! Are the names of gods. Once lost, but now restored after the second sundering. Well, the guys, we should punch these gods. Books sit close together, but are so devastated by the scroll as to be unreadable. Hmm. I Entire wonder what those are. The ends have dwindled and been reborn, hmm. silently recorded by this book. Soap tastes good. Why are you guys eating it? That's probably not a good idea. I, I don't eat the soap. I mean, sometimes I do though. Sometimes, sometimes a soap just smells so good. I'm just, I just take that, I just suck that froth right down. Hmm, scrolls of protection from good and evil. Let's loot the dead. A soul coin. Wow. A strange coin. I wonder what it's worth. Hmm. Weird. Okay. I think we've looted everything in here. All right. Ah, uh, we only have one more option now. So let's go. And get out of this cave. That went a lot better than our previous fight. <laughs> Maybe it's because we're not on tactician anymore. <laughs> yummy, yummy in my tummy. Guys, don't actually eat soap. That's that's weird. And, and probably really bad for you. Press the lever. Yeah, I am. I am. Alright, uh, do we want to long rest? Yes or no? Do we, do we want a long rest here? Or do we just want to keep going? We did leave Tactician. Everybody voted to not be on Tactician anymore. Uh, because <laughs> we did a combat and everybody was dying. And so there were a bunch of people being like, maybe we bribe to, bribe to not be on Tactician anymore. And now we're not. <laughs> Oh gosh dang it, I have the streamlabs telling you guys that it's that it's that you're it's counting your vote. Okay, it looks like we are going to long rest. Sounds good. Let's long rest. Go to camp. Have I finished the game? I haven't finished the game yet, but I'm in a, I'm I just got to act three. <clears throat> in my main playthrough. Oh, Lizelle wants to talk to us. Uh, do you guys want to talk to everybody? Yes or no? Like, is that is that something we want to do? We want to we want to talk to Lizelle and Starion. You know, do a little NPC check in because <laughs> they're here now. <laughs> Put on gym jams. Yeah, we have our gym jams on. Look at look at our gym jams. They're great.
If I don't enjoy a Divinity 2, should I not buy Baldur's Gate 3? I... I I was okay with Divi I like Divinity. It was fun. Um, I I didn't play Divinity two until after the early access of Baldur's Gate three came out, and I went. I was like, I want more of this, so I went and played Divinity. I play, played a good amount of it. I didn't beat it, but I had fun with it. Um, but the Baldur's Gate three is like an improvement on almost every level. So you might like it, but if you're if you really dislike uh, Divinity, then may then maybe then maybe not might not be your thing okay the chat the chat goofed again so we, we just we gotta wait for youtube to catch up just gonna sit here in the darkness with no chat to keep me company as it fails to load <laughs> all the emojis youtube hello There we go. Okay, it's working now. It's working now. All right, let's try that one more time. Pull number two. There we go. Um, this is just if you guys want to go talk to like talk to our companions. If that's what we want to call them, they're more like people that we've recruited. Oh yeah, I forget, keep forgetting to turn off the the poll notification. Can I can I do that? Well, I can't right now, but I can once it's done. Okay, so yes, we will, we will go talk to them, and I'm gonna fix that right now. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Lizelle, what do you want to say to us? A monster forms inside us. And you think to be idle. Oh, uh, we're being more than I idle. I knew your kind to be fragile, but I didn't foresee the severity. Oh, she's we calling us fragile. Rest. We must locate a crash. Whoa. Well, we can say we need to pace ourselves. Don't you know an exhausted warrior is an ineffective one? Or number two, we're hardly going to turn in our sleep, are we? Number three, this crash notion of yours, is it our only option? Yeah, I think I think number one is uh, definitely the most narf narf answer here. <laughs> um, but I'm I'm certain if there was an attack option, you guys would take it just because she called you. What she call us? <laughs> Fragile. Uh, it's because we're small, but we have immense amount of power. We need to pace ourselves, don't you know? An exhausted warrior is an ineffective one. A thick-headed notion in a complex circumstance. <laughs> Do you suppose the parasites inside us dare to rest? Oh. That the geich do not still pursue the us geich. with the peal of the bell? <laughs> Take your rest. I will stand watch. Okay. Should a single tentacle split your skull, I will not hesitate to end you. Yeah, I'd like to see you try, Lizel. We we killed you already, so... Don't know how well that's gonna go. Yeah, she's... She, them's fighting words. <laughs> Five is attack after dialogue. <laughs> She's, uh, yeah, she, you know, she is snarky, but I think she's worried, you know? So stand watch naked. She sure will. On our orders. Attack? Kill? You want to kill her for that? For that. You can vote on it while I go to see if Withers is here. You can vote yes or no on whether you guys want to kill Lizelle for saying that to us. Okay, Withers is here, and I think we can do the respec. We meet. I shall be here in thy camp. Um. For whenever thou hast, should thou or any of thy compatriots perish. Right, well, I'm not going to decide all of that. I'll let you guys do that. I thought it would just be a, an option. <laughs> kill and no revive. You guys just it's so funny how much of a how much of a revote we do cuz we kill and then revive right to make every companion into a bard. <laughs> it's 
into a bard? Okay, we'll do that in a second. After we talk to everybody, we'll go to Withers and see if we can respec anyone. Okay, we will not kill Lysel for that. But we will talk to Asterion. Your gift friend seems on edge. <laughs> Mustn't relish the thought of sprouting tentacles. Understandable. Can't say I'm a fan either. It's just hard to join in when all of this feels so new. All of this just feels the so new. The only means bustling streets, bursting taverns. Mm -hmm. Curling up in the dirt and resting is um, a little novel. <laughs> Um, I like that he's like, your gith friend seems on edge. And we were just like, she called us vulnerable and we were like, I almost killed you <laughs> just now. <laughs> the intrusive thoughts. All right, for dialogue, we've got number one, give it a try. We'll need uh, to be fresh tomorrow. Number two, rest our donuts up to you. Or number three, the right herbs can make a soothing tea if you can't settle in. Yeah, we got, we always got to pick the monk options. All right, we got to, we got to forward our class all right it's a, it's important that we we everybody knows that we're a monk it's a part of narf narf's entire personality bum, 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 bum. does the green screen cut out that whoa that's crazy Um, okay. Number three. Make some tea, Asterian. Uh, no. Tea isn't really my drink. Hmm, I wonder what I'll your drink is. Well, anyway. I need some time to think things through to process this. It's cum. I mean blood. You sleep. I'll keep watch. Alright, uh, we can either say, uh, thank you, I'll sleep better for that, I'm not tired yet, I'll sleep later, or we'll both stay up, I'm not ready to turn my back on a stranger. Huh? No, I didn't, I didn't say anything. I, I said his right favorite drink is... Right to uncover Asterion's butt. <laughs> <sighs> there it is! Sorry. Sorry, his butt was covered. I didn't, I didn't even realize. somebody in the chat say can we vote to mess with jacob and i'm not even playing this game i i am i am a vessel in which chat uh decides what i do <laughs> yeah of course you just need to make sure you see all the options that's exactly it okay so number three one with 60 votes which why did why was five five option five got 21 votes y'all why were you guys voting on five? <laughs> all cheeked up. All cheeked up on a Monday afternoon. Hella ass. The sun is still out. Actually, the sun is down. So. Why don't use the Twitch extension? Because we're not on Twitch. Anyways. We'll both stay up. I'm not ready to turn my back on a stranger. You know... If you want to spend time with he me, disapproved. You have to say so. That suit you, sir. I'm sure we'll drift off at some point. All right. Well. Doing the rounds, are you? You'd better get some rest. Kill, kill because he disapproved. What are you two talking about? Why is Asterion wearing that? Uh, because the the chat because the chat wanted him to wear that. That's what the chat wanted. <laughs> Ch chat. chat thought it looked really good. Um, let me get the dialogue here. Um, what do you mean? Or uh, if if that was any of your business, we'd have called you over. Or we were just discussing the next steps. You know, the next steps of tea drinking. Why are we so obsessed with threatening to kill our companions for the smallest things? I, I don't know. It's it's just Narf Narf is just she's got she's got the instinct, all right? She just is ready to punch the second anybody insults her honor. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
Short fuse, yeah. The dark urge, yeah, I know. Duh. We don't need to play Dark Urge. <laughs> you guys already are the Dark Urge. Vote three. We were just discussing the, you know, the next the next step, Shadowheart. I see. Mm-hmm. I'd be careful with Lazel. Uh, you don't trust Lazel. That's number one. Number two is, uh, you like to stir things up, don't you? Stop looking for trouble and stay focused. Or, I wasn't confiding in anyone. I was just talking. Or, if anyone has me concerned, it's you. You haven't exactly been open about yourself. Which is a funny thing to ask. Because we have not been open about ourselves either. <laughs> just be like, Shut heart, better tell me everything about yourself. Even though I don't know you and you don't know me. I'd be, uh, she's, she tells us, I'd be careful with Lizelle. We're gonna take a little defensive. I wasn't confiding anyone, I was just talking. So am I. Mm. If we're to survive, we need to trust each other. Mm. You seem reliable. I think you know how important it is that we find someone who can cure us. Best if we focus on that. Mm-hmm. Right. Uh, we can say, agreed, the sooner we find someone to help us, the better. Or, it's late, we can talk about this in the morning. Or, that's not a bad at all, Caution. This is unfamiliar territory. Hey, XP. I hey. love your DND videos. Thanks. They're entertaining and informative. You should annihilate all of your companions with <laughs> no mercy. Whoa! Then you should bring them back to life with the skeleton. Mwahahaha. <laughs> that was... Uh, normally the, the nice messages, uh, never, uh, cross over with the kill everybody messages. <laughs> that caught me off guard. Thanks for the 10, appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, everybody's got it out for the companions. They just want them dead. But then brought back to life for some reason. <laughs> just kill them just cause we can. Uh, agreed, the sooner we find someone to help us, the better. Good. We might even get lucky and find one right away. Mm. As I see it, we're overdue some good fortune. Rest well. Okay. Alright, let's go talk to Withers. Because I think we can maybe respec some stuff. And there's been a lot of people asking for that, so... Fate spins along as it should. Yeah, Shadowheart's great. Although thou dost not seem to be in need of my services. Don't hide the truth, five <laughs> wins all. Um, okay, so we can we can do the the respec. So um, I think what we're gonna do here is uh, first of all, I don't know if this is something we want to do. Um, vote two, vote. <laughs> okay, yeah. If you guys really want to change your class, I guess vote two. Uh, alert! The chat is trying to change Narf Narf from a monk. If you don't want to do that, push vote three. <laughs> Or vote one, I guess. <laughs> but maybe, maybe focus your attention into voting three. <laughs> We're just going to get pulled in different directions. This is, this is, this is intense. They sneak up on you, these these life-changing decisions. Okay, we, we are we are not gonna do that, but we could change somebody else's class. Is that something that <laughs> we wanna do? Is change any of our companions' classes. Cause there were a lot of bribes to Potentially change Lizelle or into a full bard or a Starian into every class or some reason or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Figured as much. Figured as much. Uh, okay, we will. Let me make a quick poll. 
on that. Okay, we got Lizelle, Shadowheart is number two, and Sterian will be three. Uh, and then I will also put all of them, and that will be vote four. Uh, let's use a timer. Let's do, uh, let's do 45 seconds. All right. There you go. You can vote on that. Which companion's class is getting changed? Just do one. We could do all of them. I don't know. <laughs> Of them. <laughs> Just completely respect them. <sighs> Crazy. OFC. My DND group cancels a lot, so I watch your videos on the days to satisfy my excitement for yeah. DND. Thanks for all your hard work. Oh. You are loved. Smile. Thank you so much, uh, Natalie LS. I appreciate that. That, uh, that. that goes a long way. More than you think. Thank you. Okay, we're going to change all of them. All of their classes. Alright, let's start with Shadowheart, I guess. Do we have gold for this? I don't think we have the... We have 232 gold. We can only do two. Ah, another. We don't I have enough money for this. We we, we don't have enough money for this. So we we do we do have to. <laughs> okay, we're gonna. Which for now we will do them all later. Is not getting changed. Parentheses for now. Um, and I will get rid of all of them. Okay, we have to vote on one of them not getting changed. So it's either gonna be Lizel. You'd vote one. Vote two for Shadowheart. Or vote three for Asterion. Yeah, I think I think Shadowheart's probably fine, and I <laughs> don't know what we're gonna do with Asterion, but I think Lizelle's going into Bard. Can I use Narf Narf as an important person? Of yeah, of course. Just a NPC in in a game somewhere. Okay, so Shadowheart is not gonna get. Her class changed just yet. Um, but we are going to have Lysel and Asterion have their class changed. If you guys don't make Lysel a fighter, she's not going to be able to use the birthmite. So we might need to make her... If we make her a bard, it'll just... She'll just be not proficient. And that'll be fine, I guess. I shall be here in my camp. Can you change my class? Okay, so Lysel is going to be... um, What? Uh, we gotta put all the classes in here real quick. So I gotta add, um, who did we do last? It was Lysel, so it was Fighter. So I think I need to add Fighter back in. Uh, okay, so Fighter, Fighter, oops, Fighter, uh, Advanced. Let's not send the chat notifications. Okay, so multi -cl class choice group A. <laughs> Got Bard, Barbarian, Druid, Monk, Paladin, and Rogue. Um, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I thought I no. I, I'm I'm gonna add fighter into the the to group B. Yeah. Uh, okay. So uh, what, we're gonna completely respec her. What is she gonna be? I know it says multi class option. It's just class option. What makes the least sense for her? Definitely Bard. Like, ba she is, she could fit into any of these classes. I'd even say Druid. Like, she could maybe be a Druid. But Druid and Bard are the furthest from her <laughs> character possible. Uh, make her a rogue. Yeah, rogue would be interesting. Um, the fact that you can do this, I think, is cool. The fact that you can just take these characters and make them completely different classes, I think, is, is really, really interesting. Bardarian. A, bar a barbarian bard? That'd be pretty funny. 
Um, all right, so Bard gets votes with seven. It's seventy-eight votes on Bard, um, and then sixty-one votes on Paladin. So let me just write those real quick: seventy-eight Bard, sixty-one Paladin, uh, and then we are going to complete that one. And we're going to do choice B. I got to add Fighter back into this. Uh, and we'll do 45 seconds and, uh, add fighter and just make sure the chat notifications aren't on yet. Okay. Uh, go for it. If any of these beat the previous votes, uh, because, uh, Bard has 78 votes and Paladin has 61 votes. So if any of these beat those, then we will go with that class instead. A lot going for fighters still. If you guys just make her what she already is, we just wasted a hundred gold. Ugh. Bard, paladin, yeah, I know, right? You can also just abstain if you don't want any of these uh any of these classes. Okay, uh, Fighter got 53 votes, so uh, it's currently Bard and Paladin, uh, between Bard and Paladin. So uh, we will do that vote real fast. Uh, final class vote, Bard will be vote Bard, and then Paladin will be vote Paladin. And that's going to be 45 seconds, and uh, go for it. Bard or Paladin? Paladin would be crazy cool. I just want to say, Bard is is meme -y and funny. He he ha ha. She's a Bard and she's not supposed to be. And that that the Bardic inspiration is great. And we could always multiclass her. But her going into Paladin is crazy cool. Like that the fact that we could like give her smites and stuff. That's just not only fitting for her character, but like it would, she's just gonna be really strong. Because you don't really get a Paladin companion in this game. Yeah, look look at the Paladin sweep. Paladin's hella cool. Alright, cool. Lysel's gonna be healing, casting cool spells. Sounds awesome. Okay, so vote... Uh, we're gonna do one, two, and three votes here for her subclass. So we can do one will be Oath of the Ancients, two will be Oath of Devotion, and three will be Oath of Vengeance. Um, Oath of the Ancients is you fight on the side of light and the cosmic struggles against darkness to preserve the sanctity of life and the beauty of nature. Get Healing Radiance and Oath of the Ancients Tenants, which is Kindle the Light, Shell of the Light, Preserve Your Own Light. Oath of Devotion, um, uh, following the ideal of a knight in shining armor, get Holy Rebuke. And then Oath of Vengeance is set aside your own purity to right wrongs and deliver justice, which is, I, I don't know, very Lysel. Um, and you get Inquisitor's Might, which is you can deal two radiant damage and daze enemies for a turn, which is pretty cool. Yeah, look at all the votes for vengeance it's so fitting for her you guys went really meme with with the bard but now it's like nah we're it's like make everybody bard huh, pranked you we're gonna make lysel even more of a of a fitting class than fighter was truly the 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 real subversiveness was uh picking something cool all along Okay, we're going to have to respec her abilities. Uh, we're going to do what I did in Character Creator earlier, which was uh, to probably... I'll, I'll spec them, but I'll leave it up to you guys. Um, you can vote yes or no. Vote yes if you want me to do the stats. Vote no if you guys want to do it. Up to you. <clears throat> All right, uh, I I I can do her stance. That's 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 fine. <clears throat> or did I say vote yes if if you want vote yes if you want me to do it. Vote no if you guys want to do it. That's what I said, right? Optimize the stats. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, I'll do it. Okay, I, I will do her stats. So she's got to have some charisma. Um, some dex is good. Strength is fine. I think we definitely need to go full into strength. Um, but I think having some charisma may not be bad. So um, I think having con is good. I think I'm just going to take this out of dex. Put this into um, charisma. Um, and I think we're going to go low and... 
Having constitution is good. Um, we, if we could just get one point. Oh, we got to go down two for one point. I think this is good. Because um, she's not going to do a lot of the thinking and the wisdom. I mean, yes, this is good for like insight and stuff. But I think it's just going to be better if she's just more into the damage. Um, and then let's go... Uh, Persuasion, I guess. That's fine. And then uh, and then religion. We'll do that. Cool. Confirm. Okay. Uh, we'll do one more vote on her multi-classing or not. So, um, obviously, don't vote Paladin. <laughs> well, you can actually. Uh, go ahead and vote on what you what you guys want her to go into uh, next. Uh, you can vote Bard, Barbarian, Druid, Monk, Paladin, or or Rogue. We'll just do it this way from now on. Um, she can just be two levels in Paladin, which I think is cool. She got smites um, and spells, which is neat. Uh, or you know, we can put her in Bard, but we can always put her in Bard later. We're gonna get we're gonna get levels later. Can totally be a thing. Multiclassing at level two is is so weird. <laughs> Dang, so many votes for Paladin. Paladin... Lizelle being, a, Lizelle being a Paladin makes me want to make her a Paladin in my game. Like, in my... In my, um... My single-player game. It just sounds really cool. Alright, Paladin with 122 votes. Uh, let's go ahead and get choice B. I'll make this guy a little bigger. There we go. <clears throat> That'd be crazy if she goes Oathbreaker too. I gotta gotta look at the tenants and stuff. But Lysel just isn't making a lot of choices, so we'll see. Narf Narf will make her abandon it entirely. Yeah, a little more spread out here, and I think that's just because the Paladin sweep took the nation by storm. <laughs> A little bit of a vote for Warlock, but... Which is also, Paladin-Warlock is such a cool combination, too. Um, but, alright, she's going Paladin. Um, level 2 into Paladin. We're getting Divine Smites, Reactions, and Critical... Why are these, like, special abilities? <laughs> it's just Smite. Um, okay. Fighting Style. Go ahead and vote on our Fighting Style. Go 1 through 4. Number 1 is going to be Defense. She'll get a plus 1 to AC. While she wears armor, which I don't think she's doing. <laughs> Number two is dueling. Um, if you're wielding a single weapon that isn't two-handed or versatile, which she isn't doing. Um, and then great weapon fighting. That one's awesome, which is you roll one or two on a damage die. can re-roll it, which she is using. Or protection. If she has a shield, which Let's she isn't doing. Paladin of the Mud Chicken. She's Lizel devoted pa Paladin of the Mud Chicken. Yeah, definitely. She is she is swearing herself to to <laughs> to the usurper, Narf Narf. And she makes her oath to the mud chicken. I think I'm gonna turn the alert box up a little bit. It's a little quiet. I'm just gonna put that at like ninety percent. There we go. Um, all right, we're gonna go great weapon fighting. You guys are you guys Oath are min maxing. Jacob. Yep. Oath of Lil Jacob? I thought you just said hey Jacob. Oath of Lil Jacob. <laughs> oh. If only Narf Narf's name was Lil Jacob. <laughs> okay, um, are you guys cool with these spells? Um, or do you wanna change them? How how do we, how do we feel about these spells? We've, we've got a uh, command, compelled duel, bless, cure wounds, and wrathful smite. Those are pretty good. I mean, I guess there is also searing smite, uh, and protection from evil and good, and shield of faith, and thunderous smite, and divine favor that we could also take. But I mean, up to y'all. Command everything in the game. Yeah, that'd be that'd be that'd be funny. Protection from evil and and good. Yeah. We could take that, even though I think Shadowheart has that for being a ranger. <laughs> Heroism and Searing Smite? 
Okay, we're just gonna keep the we're just gonna keep these spells. Sounds good. <clears throat> All right. Um. Now we're gonna you know respec Asterian, <laughs> buddy. <laughs> God, the disrespect to this man. Ah, I shall be here in. All right, uh, what's Nath Asterion Nath going is into? Will Jacob in my heart, and that's all that matters. Oh yes, of course, but Arkist. Narf, Narf, live on under the under her old name of Lil Jacob. <laughs> Look at him in the in the menu. Standing like that in his, in his leathers. <laughs> uh, we're gonna make a Starry in a bard. What? What a plot twist. I mean, he's he definitely looks like one. It's a bard if I've ever seen one. <laughs> God. Um, okay, so that was like 132 votes. Uh, uh, now, multi-class group B. Or just class group B. Ranger, sorcerer, warlock, wizard, cleric, or fighter. What the hell is he wearing? <laughs> the, the, the Assyrian is just wearing this just to shock anybody who shows up to the stream. <laughs> chat put him in that chat chat wanted him to wear that they killed him and brought him back to life and then said this is your new outfit Asterion hope you like it a lot coming out for warlock we could just make him full warlock too alright looks like looks like we're going bard full bard or just at least first level in bard um, we're gonna take these. Do, do you guys want to change his cantrips? Go ahead. You can change his cantrips. Those are a little important. He's not a prep caster, so vote one if you want vicious mockery. Vote two if you want blade ward. Vote three if you want mage hand. Vote four for true strike. Vote five for friends. Vote six for dancing lights. Vote seven for light, and vote eight for minor illusion. True strike, yeah. True strike is not. He's not a rogue anymore, so it's not gonna be very good. <laughs> But Disney, uh, not Disney Whispers, Vicious Mockery will be funny because I want to, like, hearing his voice lines. God, we gotta, we gotta zoom him in a little bit. <laughs> Cod pieces hanging out. Uh, Alright, so it looks like uh, options one and five are our winners so one two three four five and friends so vicious mockery and friends um and then <laughs> spells you just want to keep these spells i think i think we i think we should just keep these spells but it's up to you you can vote yes or no he's currently going to get a uh, dissonant whispers tasha city's laughter heroism and healing word I don't know why when I'm streaming, for some reason, I tense my ears really hard. Like, all of my, like, I have to remember that I'm not putting all of my, I have to remember to relax my head, because I can, like, move my ears, and I just hold them. I just, like, tense them for some reason. It's like, am I using my brain? Like, what am I doing? Okay, we'll just keep those spells. Sounds good. You gotta vote on his instrument. <laughs> Most important thing. So number one will be a drum. Number two will be a flute. Number three is a lute. Number four is a lyre. And number five is a violin. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it's really funny if you get an instrument in this game and you aren't like proficient in playing a musical instrument and you just play a song and you just play it very badly. It's hilarious. It's funny that you can even do that. Oh, give him the violin. Interesting. That's very fitting for Asterion, for him to have a violin. That's just 
That just that just seems right. All right, I thought you guys were being a goof. I thought you guys were being silly, but you, you guys just seem to be cre crafting the party you want based on your interactions with the character. So, I take it back. This this is less of a less of a meme than I than I thought it was. With 69 votes, he's got a violin. Okay, um, do you guys want to do his stats, or do you want me to do them? Vote yes if you want to decide his stats, and vote no if you want me to do it. And by deciding stats, we'll just do a singular six poll, and I'll just rank them that way. Or you can vote no. Vote no if you just want me to do it, and I'll, I'll, stat, I'll stat him up. But I think you guys want him to be good. <laughs> That's what I've seen so far. So everybody's like, please... Please make them good. <laughs> these choices are so permanent. I guess they're not. We did just change everything about these characters. This is literally the exact opposite of what we did earlier. Yeah, you guys had a real sh hot character moment. Character shift here. Um, no. Alright, I will just do it then. Uh, let's go... All in charisma. <laughs> make this guy, make this man as char char charismatic as possible. Let's go as far into Dex as we can. Uh, and then I think, I think Con at 10, and then I think we go, I think we just level him out a little bit. Keep his strength low, and then kind of give him um, a bit of intelligence. I think that's, that's, that's the best way to go here, just so he can recall things. Um, or maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because that makes sense with like being a bard and stuff. Um, and then... Sh sure. It intimidation, performance, and persuasion. Maybe not performance. We'll go stealth, just because it just seems to be in his nature. Um, and we'll do that. Okay, um, you can multi-class him if you want, or he can go into Bard again. Entirely up to you. He will get Jack of All Trades and Song of Rest and a new spell. So that that's that that could be good. But if you guys wanted to multi-class, I mean, vote for it. The game's about to get very different. Lizelle being a paladin is really hype, though. That's that's very that's very fun. Okay, we got 111 votes on Bard. Let's go B. The most interesting part of the stream, voting on Asterian's class. It's important though, you know, he's gonna favor in combat pretty well. Or, you know, abstain from this if you want Bard to win. He can also do that. The problem players, me, have been overthrown. Yeah, everybody was like, haha, that was funny when everybody was dying and naked. Now make Asterion a bard and Lysel a paladin, and it'll be cool. I like that every time we get to this, it's just a full blast on Warlock. <laughs> but it just does not get the, the, the amount of votes. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna we're gonna make him level two bard. Um, we get a new spell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You guys already voted on me choosing spells, so um, I think charm person would just be really fitting. The fact that he could take cure wounds is funny though. Disguise self is pretty cool. Um, Oh, thanks, General Scrappy. I'm glad I have a relaxing presence. I feel like I don't. I feel like this is very chaotic. But, um... The leading theory for the drop in chaos is just that the goofballs got bored and they leave. Yeah, really. Make him an orc? We can't make him an orc. Featherfall is pretty good. Speak with animals? Speak with animals is fun. Cure wounds? Um, speak with animals is great in this game. Speak with animals. But lots, lots of speak with animals. So we'll do that. Okay. Our little boy is a bard now. Okay, now, well, if the Chaos Gremlins have left, maybe maybe we can get away with a little vote here. 
Maybe, should we put Asterian's clothes back on? <laughs> vote yes or vote no. Maybe we could. Maybe we could put his his armor back on, and I and maybe I won't get demonetized as I stream these. <laughs> Everybody's like, no! <laughs> we may be making good decisions, but the Kusterian will not have his clothes back on. <laughs> I can literally talk to animals. What does that leave me? Rocks and trees. <laughs> yeah, really. Okay, we... we <laughs> We won't put his clothes back on. We'll keep him off. Looking ahead. We, we are of one mind still. Okay, time to long rest. Mm, okay, tonight we're eating some fish and this dried beef sausage and some stout stew and mixed coffee. Mmm, this harsh but invigorating coffee and this drink is tempered by smooth, soothing milk tea. Best supped in grand plazas of music and blue pink light. I like they were drinking coffee before bed. <laughs> and then some and some apples. Mmm. Alright. Oh, okay, we can vote again. Do you guys want to put Lysel in armor? Vote yes or no on that while we situate ourselves in the morning here. And Lysel still has the drum from her cross class into Bard for a minute, which is really funny. So we do want to put Lizelle's armor back on. That's, that's fair. That I think because she's a paladin now, it just makes sense. She get proficiency in heavy armor for being a paladin. That'd be cool. Free drum, <laughs> yeah. We get a free drum. Full knight outfit. Yeah, I mean her Gith Yankee armor is just really cool. We have her undies. It's all we needed. Yeah. Okay, uh, we will put our armor back on. That sounds good. Lysel, put your armor back on. I, I like that it's in her inventory, but it's not... Okay, I think it's in the camp. We put it in the camp stash. I like she still has Asterian's underwear, though. All right, Lizelle's looking pretty sick. Let's leave camp. Are you moving with Wazd? Yeah. How are you moving with Wazd? I'm not moving with Wazd. Um, I'm dragging, dragging and clicking. Um, so if you if you drag the mouse um, and click forward, you, you can go like this. And then I also just push uh, the middle mouse button to steer. So I, I kind of do it like this sometimes. <laughs> Oh, no shoes? Does she not have shoes on? Now she's... Put your shoes on. There we go. She's got her shoes on. Yeah, if you hold left click, you can you can, you can can do that. And then uh, sometimes I'll, I'll, I'll wazd ahead. But if you hold click, it'll just go back to your character. So, Bitrate seems low. Yeah, YouTube is telling me that. The stream's current bitrate is lower than the recommended bitrate. We recommend you stream with a higher bitrate. I don't know if I can change that, but let me look. Oh yeah, the bitrate is really low. Why is it doing that? Well, I can't change it because I'm currently streaming. So, um, next time I will increase the bitrate. Ooh! Curious. A dirt mound! Gold! And a potion of feather fall! Amazing! We're taking that because that's all that's that's all Narf Narf knows how to do. Shoes off. Okay. Vote if you want her shoes off. You vote yes for shoes off. Vote no for keep her shoes on. That might be worth a look. Oh, and another dirt mound that we can loot. Oh, some scrolls. Very nice. Okay, we've got a couple of options now. Um, I think we're going to move this way because we've already investigated that area. And we're going to head along the road. Uh, it looks like we're going <laughs> to... 
No is winning? Okay, great. Cool. We'll, we'll, we'll take Lizelle's shoes off. I'm so sorry that I put her shoes on. We'll keep the grippers out. Um, okay, we got a couple of options of where we can go here. We're just gonna uh, move forward. It's kind of our only direction. Um, <laughs> whoa, there's a crazy portal going on over here. So we can go left or right. Um, can vote. If we go left, we'll investigate this portal. If we go right, we will ignore that and we will go this way. Decide. Go back? What do you mean? Wait, that meant that meant keep her shoes on? Did I? Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. Did I completely misunderstand? Jacob meant shoes. No, meant shoes on. I'm so sorry. I I I reverse psychologyed myself. I put her shoes back on. Please forgive me, chat. Please forgive me. <laughs> I, I, I goofed my own self. I, 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 will, I will never fail you again. I, I apologize. I apologize. Her shoes are back on. Her shoes are back on. All right, we're going left, and we're going to investigate that portal. Here goes nothing. Get my husband, Gale. Agree. I love Gale so much. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically. As if malfunctioning. It looks Whoa. slightly dangerous. Uh, alright, so we can um, touch the sigil or leave. <laughs> touch the sigil? Yeah, I'm um, kind of weird and counterintuitive that we wouldn't just do that i love there's always some folks just voting for five and i you know so every time every time that happens it just makes me think of clone wars of, of fucking fives just just oh just sevens for five hold strong <laughs> yeah okay um that's that's pretty unanimous we'll we'll vote do one touch the sigil Pulls in the way. I love how his little hand just shoots out like that. It's so funny. Um, okay. Uh, uh, there you go. We can say, who are you? Or we can <laughs> we can slap the hand with number two. <laughs> or strength, grab the hand and pull. Or it's far too dangerous. Leave him to his fate. <laughs> yeah. Narf Narf is, is one to punch anything that is in front of her. Just makes the most sense. Slap. <laughs> so we... We come across a strange portal. It's like, what's this over here? And then a hand shoots out of it. And our first instinct is to slap it. Ah! should have clarified <laughs> hmm? helping and <laughs> and <laughs> just slap it oh that's so funny all right we can we can ask who are you or we can use our strength and pull or we, it's far too dangerous just leave him to his fate there's so many people in the chat who are just like stay on target get the companion stay on target chat He's just, he's just, he's just real stressed out over there. His hand just flinging all over the place. Please. And we were just like, did we slap it or did we give him a high five? Like, I don't, what was the entail of the slap? No option for slap again. <laughs> just, just keep slapping it. Like, get out of here. Shoo. Strength, grab the hand and pull. All right. Uh, we gotta make a little check here. Um, we can add a little guidance. Um, it's a DC-7. I don't think we need to waste a bardic inspiration on this. Alright, we good. We good. 
Grab him, Narf Narf. Help him. Go on. Keep pulling. Pull Gale right off. I mean, out. I mean, out. Pull him out and then slap slap him again. Just like, all right, fine. Just keep slapping. Maybe, maybe not. The, the chat is right. There's a lot of chaos you can cause with with Gale. Hello. <laughs> oh God, Asterian. In the background. Uh, whoops. Let's see. Uh, we can say, no need to apologize, are you alright? Add introductions? Because he said, apologies, I'm usually better at this. Or, at not wasting time of passing adventurers, I certainly hope so. <laughs> Narf Narf's gonna turn out to be really sassy. The YouTube chat decided to explode again, so I'm going to cancel the poll real fast. YouTube chat! You! Okay, there we go. It fixed. I'm going to try one more time. Uh, boop! There you go. Options one through three. I think Gale's just too nice, and I don't think we can piss him off. I just don't. I just don't know if that's that's in our capability. Gale's just real sweet. Got Asterian in the corner over here, my my guy. Put that thing away. Ugh. Stand stand back a little bit, dude. Jeez. Okay, looks like we're gonna say number. Whoa. Oh, uh, it tied? It tied! Uh, I'm gonna open the poll again. Just to see what our final votes are. It's still tied. It's still tied! Once the next set of votes come in, that's when we're... Oh! It was one. It was one vote for two. Okay, that those last couple of ones came in for, for number two. Um, okay, so, at introductions. That magic. Hmm. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the Norse Lloyd as well. How does he know that? How does he know that? So we can say, I was, yes. Or, never mind the Nauta Lloyd. How did you get stuck in that stone? Or number three, you don't trust this man. Draw your weapon. <laughs> any chance, any time there's a chance to, uh, Bright you know. to steal Gale's clothes and multi-class him into Barbarian. This whole game is just going to be multi-classing the companions. Killing them, st stealing their clothes, re respecting them. <laughs> I'll query it with the chat, but, you know, you, you can bribe me for polls, but you can't bribe me to make decisions. Um, okay. You don't trust this man. Draw your weapon. Whoa. <laughs> Easy does it. Really, really don't want to do that. Hmm, why not? Not a threat. Just an observation. Just an observation. Narf Narf's ready to fight! Narf Narf's ready to throw down! No, no. We can either sheath our weapon, just put our fists down, or... And why would I really, really not want to attack you? Or we can... Attack. Alright, this is it. This is going to be your guys' one option to kill Gale. In the future, it's going to need to proc something. He's going to go unconscious or do something you guys don't like. But this is your one chance. I'm not saying don't waste it. I'm saying that we're not going to sit here <laughs> and decide whether or not Gale should die after you're getting your option right now. <laughs> Gale didn't even do anything to us. He just came out of a portal. Why are, why are we going to kill him? What, what has sparked this? I know some of you are living for the chaos, but I'm very curious as to as to this this train of thought of just whacking all of the companions as soon as they, as soon as they show up. <laughs> okay, we're going number two. Uh, and why would I really, really not want to attack you? Ten years of bad luck if you kill a wizard. <laughs> why take the risk? Ah. <sighs> You have to vote again. 
You have to vote again, chat. <laughs> to either sheath your weapon or attack Gale. Oh no. Bribe to make a poll allowing us to vote on whether you can make decisions based on bribes or not. That is extremely meta. Um, uh, okay. I will make... <laughs> I, that may be swayed. Purely because of, of a couple of reasons. Number one, I think the people who are bribing are in the vast minority. And number two, uh, I think that... Uh, uh, no, I th I th that's it. That's it. Okay, we are going to sheath our weapon. Put those fists down. Much obliged. Besides, I suspect the real villain here is one we have in common. <laughs> Kale was the ship, terrified. Were receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. Mm. Are you not? Uh, we... We don't want 10 years of bad luck. Yeah, 10 years of bad luck sounds terrible. We, we, Narf Narf doesn't want that. You kill a wizard and get 10 years bad luck? Pfft. Narf Narf's intelligence is 8. <laughs> she doesn't know any better. Yeah, sheath your weapon is put your fist down. Yeah, those Narf Narf's fists are deadly weapons. Couldn't have phrased it more repellently myself. Is that an option number two? Come on, get a little smaller. There we go. <laughs> Couldn't have phrased... He said, back on the ship, you were t on the receiving end of another a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region, were you not? <laughs> Couldn't have phrased it more repellently myself. No you sugarcoating it, is there? The insertee we speak of, this parasite. Are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? It's a process known as ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is, it to, is be to be avoided. avoided. It is to be avoided. You don't happen to be a cleric by any chance, do you? They made his hair so hot. Surgeon. Like, in, I remember in early access, it was just kind of just there. Now, he, now he's all like, now he's you just like, he's all rizzed up. To realize it's beyond most cleric skills. <laughs> most, no doubt. But I find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few. You don't happen to be one of them. Um. Well, we can say I was going to ask you the same question, or can't say that I am. <laughs> Not a lot of uh. Not not a whole lot of choice there on what we're gonna say, but still. Bribe to poll to change Gale's class to barbarian as soon as we have one hundred gold. That is two bribes to change him to barbarian, so we will definitely pull that as soon as we have a hundred gold. Or we'll pull that right after this. There's <laughs> so many vote five. So many of you cast your vote into vote five. Gale Barian? Make, make Gale a barbarian. Just He's all talking about how he's a magical wizard, and he's just like, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm a barbarian. I'd never casted a spell in my life. Uh, all right, we're going to say number two. Can't say that I am. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon, too. Mm -hmm. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more, Look for a healer together. Wow. Well, chat, are we going to take Gale with us? Are we going to make him a Gale Barian or, or whatever? <laughs> Bar Bargalian? <sighs> I can't believe you can do that. The fact that we have the option to do that. I take it back. Whatever you've done to Asterion up here, you know, what you've done to him, won't even compare to making Gale a Barbarian. That'd be the most chaotic, meme decision you guys would have made. <laughs> the game is too kind. <laughs> we don't fight, we five. There's so many of you voting five. What happens if five wins? <laughs> I choose... 
Um, all right, number one. Uh, sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me, Gail. Oh, I see you're traveling with plenty of company already. Mm. Perhaps I can join you later instead. Oh, okay. I'll make my way to your camp. Sounds good. Go to our camp. Uh, do you guys want to take Gale? Do you want to go get him? You can say yes or no. We can go swap somebody out if you want to take him, or we can just, you know, let him hang out in our camp. Completely up to you. Gale's pretty cool. Alright, looks like we are gonna go get Gale, which is great. Gale's Gale's cool. Gale's Gale's a lot of fun as a wizard, as a spellcasting wizard that he is. Good thing we don't have any uh, more gold to <laughs> turn him not into a wizard. Um, okay, who do you want to swap out for him? Bribe to kill off a companion if five wins a poem. Wow. Um, all right. I mean, that's that's what five will be. Five will be whatever the previous bribe was. That's That will be what option five is. So, sure, if in a future poll five wins... Currently, we will kill off another companion. Um, we'll we'll go to, we'll go to camp. Just kill him off if I was. I like that Lizelle still has that drum on her, just on her back as a drum. <laughs> but she's not proficient anymore. She forgot how to use it. <laughs> Bribe to Bribe to replace Astrian with Gale. Astrian? Who's Astrian? Bribe to replace Asterian with Gale? You guys can't bribe the votes. Like, it was already... <laughs> bribe to not do that. This... <laughs> you, guys, you guys are bribing to, to re-poll? <sighs> okay, look. It, I normally don't do this, but we will re-poll. But you can't bribe me to rig the election, alright? You guys have to decide. Alright, I'll re-poll. Here's another poll. You guys can completely repoll that if you want to. If you want to swap out Asterian for Gale. But uh, I'm not doing this all the time. But I feel I feel generous. And you guys are feeling generous with all your donations. So thank you so much. really appreciate that. It looks like everybody still wants it to be Shadow Heart. <laughs> which, is, which is the chat's decision. That is, that is chat has decided... I am way too easily swayed by donations. No, not at all, not at all. It is just a re-poll. I didn't, I didn't decide. All right, it's gonna be Shadowheart. Shadowheart is honestly, I was there. There more. Some of it being donations. Some of it also being staring at a Starian like this is is just, <laughs> it's just heinous. And I was I was almost hoping it would be a Starian, but it's fine. I've heard you can't get blood from a stone, but apparently you can get a wizard from one. Mm-hmm. Okay, you um we'll journey separately for now. Sure. Yep. I'm um, I'm um, yep. Stay here. I'm um, we, we need Gale. It's important. First in magic, are you? Um. <laughs> okay, he wants to talk to us <laughs> before we recruit him. Um. I'm not. Why do you ask? Or pester me another time? <laughs> Just be mean to him. <laughs> oh, the green screen is freaking out. How to fix that? Oh, now I'm too green. Well. Uh. There, that's fine. Um, <laughs> five is getting so many votes now, which is, 
What was it again to put to to make Gale a barbarian to vote on him barbarian being a barbarian? Gale use brains from the Nautiloid as improvised weapons. The brains from the Nautiloid as improvised weapons. Wow. What what a what a crazy thing. I can't remember what it was. It was it was just to make Gale a barbarian, I think. Or to kill one of the companions is what it was. Lesel with a stallion. Bribe to <laughs> All right, we'll we'll revote on on that, um, but uh, we're gonna say one, which is I'm not. Why do you ask? No matter to worry the unlettered over. If you meet any elder wizards, elder wizards. No. There is a matter I'd like to seek advice on from a. Bribe to put barbarian Gale in Lesel's underwear. <laughs> <laughs> if we get around to it, okay. Do you guys want to swap out? Um, what was it? A a Starian or Lysel for? Shadowheart? I don't know. Do you guys want to swap anybody else out? While I get Gale. What's on your mind? Uh, join me. We and, oh, we gotta level up Gale. Oh my god. Oh. Um, we could, we could swap out Lysel or, or Asterion if you guys wanted to. Um, so if you don't want to, we can just say no, which is fine. <laughs> Bribe to romance Asterion. <laughs> to romance Asterion? I mean, you guys are... You guys have gotten, like, one or two... You've gotten a disapprove and an approve. What, what, what is his approval rating with us right now? It is... It is not good. It is neutral. They, he has no strong feelings towards us. Neither does... Neither does Lysel. Rain fart moment. Sorry. Smiley face. But still Asterion Lesel. Oh, Aster Asterian over Lysel, got it. Okay, so we're not going to change out our party, which is fine. Um, we, we've got who we want. Um, <sighs> there are people saying it in chat and there's donations. <laughs> Just going to ask. Bribe to keep Asterian so we can fix him. Do you guys want to put Gale in in Lysel's underwear? Put, put, we're going to put Gale in this, in what Asterian is currently in. Do you guys want to do that? And it, you know, I'm just seeing a lot of it. Additional See? bribe to put Gale in Lesel's underwear. <laughs> That's what we're voting on. And it looks like a lot of people want to do that. <laughs> this game has so far just kind of been a uh, dress-up simulator. Just what horrible things can we do the, to the companions? Immediately. <laughs> Which is really funny. I want to romance Carlock. Yeah, really. Carlock is 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 the best. All right. What are we putting Asterian in? Do you, okay. Do you so vote one to put Asterian? Okay. Vote one to put Asterian in his normal armor. Vote two to put him in Gale's underwear. Vote three to put him in a different set of armor. <laughs> Everybody's voting for five. Five, I guess, is killing a companion. <laughs> if the intrusive thoughts become more powerful than than uh, uh, Gale's underwear, <laughs> so we're gonna keep a staring in underwear. But we're gonna we're gonna put Gale in the in the leather straps. <laughs> oh my god, that's funny as hell. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> Gail, put on put on your new stuff. Take those clothes off, Gail. <laughs> Whoa, Asterian's looking pretty good. Look at Asterian. Wow. All right, Gail, put it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> He's kind of pulling it off, to be honest. It looks better on him than it does on Asterion. I got, I gotta be completely honest. Oh no, the top pulls in the way. Sorry. He, he his look bad. He looks pretty good. <laughs> the leaf. We're not putting him in the leaf. I already said. Hang on. Let me make the stream go dark real fast because I don't want YouTube to demonetize me. I'm almost certain. If we, yeah, we can't. We can't. 
I can't put a Starion in the leaf. You get you get the full frontal leaf. There you go. But that's all you get. Because his cheeks are fully out. <laughs> I guess Gales are too, but I mean, at least there's a little bit of clothing there. There's, there's at least something there. My god. Do you guys want to keep his boots on? Dis yes, yes, if you want to keep his boots so on. Milf, take his boots off. Underwear. <laughs> so who's going to wear Shadow Hearts underwear? Shadow Heart is! <laughs> That's who's wearing Shadow Hearts underwear. They everybody wanted oh everybody wanted Starion and Gale's underwear. Oh. So yes, keep his boots on. Alright, we'll 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 do. He looks pretty good in the boots, to be honest. Just just in the under in the underwear. No shoe, no shoes, no shirt, but I still get service. Obviously, Narf Narf should wear Shadow Hearts underwear. All right, it's the underwear stream to today. To be fair, the vote wasn't to make Gale not wear armor or clothing. That's true. Okay, we, we'll pull that as well. Okay, do you guys want to put armor on Gale? Yes or no? Or do you just want to keep him in the underwear? Vote no if we just keep him in the in the in the leather straps. Yeah, that's that's what I thought. <laughs> he's the he's the he's the most skin showing wizard the world ever seen. Yeah, I'll, I'm not gonna let you guys have your cake and eat it too. I I ref if you guys want him in the underwear, we we aren't do. I am fully aware you can do this. I am. I know you can do this, and we can make, and you can give him his armor still. But if you guys want this, it, this is how it has to be. <laughs> you have to commit. Commit to the underwear. <laughs> okay, um, now, uh, there was another thing you guys wanted to vote for. Oh, do you guys want Narf Narf in Shadow Hearts underwear? And that's the last underwear vote we're going to vote on, because it's going to take the entire game. <laughs> <laughs> but I, but I, I, of course, Chad, it is important. It is very important to know who's wearing whose underwear. It's, uh, it's, it's important to the lore. Okay, Narf Narf is going to wear Shadow Hearts underwear. Great video idea. Ball as gate players play D and D for the mm -hmm. first time. Sorcerer tries to cast Fireball <laughs> twice in one round. Really? Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Baller's Gate players. Yeah. It, that's a exactly it. Yeah. There's so many rules from Baldur's Gate though that I think would be really fun for. For uh, right, like D and D and stuff. Wear shadow hearts crown thing. Oh my god, that's ours. We already voted on that. That's for us. Hi, hi. All right, here's our our daily. Marcy says hi to the stream. Um, she wants my water. Do you want some water? Mmm. Yummy. I was a stripper in my youth, and this is eerily similar. <laughs> in your youth. What, what's similar? The fact that we're all voting on the different types of underwear, or the fact that Gale looks like that? What did you do to Gale? Oh, they put him in Lizelle's underwear instead. Oh. Marcy's just happy sitting here, drinking water. Okay, Marcy, now we're going to go to Narf Narf, and we're going to go into the inventory. Why and, do you get to have your clothes on? Uh, because nobody yeah. wants Narf Narf in her underwear. Everybody already said that. We have to dismiss Lizelle for a second to get to the get it. Was a useful find. Wait in camp. Check. We'll, we'll get you back. You believe you can survive with, just stay here. We just, we, just, we just need Shadow Heart for a second so we can get the underwear. Everybody loves you, Marcy. They're all saying you're very cute and sweet. Mmm. Oh. oh, she liked that. Something the matter. 
Yeah, um, can you join me for a second, Shadowheart? It's really important that you join me for a sec. Uh, we just need your, we just need your underwear. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for that. Something matter. Yeah, um, stay in camp. <laughs> if you're sure. Mm -hmm, mm hmm I'm sure. Fine. Yep. Sounds good. Thanks. <laughs> Marcy approved. <laughs> um, okay, Lizelle, why don't you join back up? <laughs> yeah, join. It is done. Okay, um, do you guys want Narf Narf to be wear to be naked? Up to you. I am not gonna put her monk armor on. She will have to be naked like everybody else. You can say yes or no. Drinking all my water, dude. Marceline. You're so sweet. She's fine. She's walking, guys. She knows how to walk. It's, it's so cool to, to see you walking. <laughs> you just want some water? <laughs> Her out there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Can you wave? Good job. Good job. Go to mama. <clears throat> oh, okay. Arrive to add Love five you. to all yes slash you. no poles. No booleans in Baldur's Gate Plaza. Add a five to all yes no poles. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that, but... um. <laughs> But uh, uh, I appreciate the attempt at your bribe. No booleans in Baldur's Gate. What? What is? What is? What? What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Yes, we're gonna be. Okay. Narf Narf is gonna be naked, wearing Shadowheart's underwear. Whoa, that's crazy. Damn. That's. This is a wild. This is a wild stream, everybody. <sighs> boolean is a yes or no choice sometimes you gotta have boolean choices guys it's necessary there's a, there there's 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 so many of you all right now we're gonna level up gale so <laughs> are we multi-classing gale yes or no The amount of screen time dedicated to the characters being in these leathers is ridiculous. Being tortured live on stream. Actually, I don't really mind it on Gale. Kind of looks good on Gale. Look at, look at, he's kind of, he kind of, he kind of owns it, to be honest. I feel like you would give that to Asterion and he'd be like, fine, I'll wear it. But if you gave it to Gale, he'd be like, <laughs> he'd be like, I used to wear something like this when I was within Mistra's embrace. <laughs> I think it looks rather dashing on me. <clears throat> if you say so, I'll, I'll wear the leathers for you, Narf Narf. I'm staring to be like, right, yeah. So long as you don't kill me again. That would be that would be their various reactions. <sighs> okay, we're in a multi-class gale. Yeah, showing showing it showing one side of his netheries orb, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Um, okay. Complete the poll. Gale definitely gets pegged. <laughs> By Mistro. 100%. Um, okay. So, decide the multi-class. What's that on his chest? You'll find out. We'll find out what's on his chest. Don't listen to anything I said. It's probably probably absolutely nothing at all. You know? It's probably fine. The highlights of this stream are going to be demonetized for sure. You, you know, we'll see. We, we I can get creative. Did Gale get killed as well? No, Gale did not get killed. The chat had two options to attempt to kill Gale. They did not. Instead, they put him in, in, the, in the leathers. El Elminster. Elminster told me this is where all initiates were. Yeah, exactly. Um, Barbarian. Of course. Barbarian with 113 votes. <laughs> does this look like the face of a barbarian to you? It does to me. <laughs> Do a... <laughs> 
I'll let that go through the text to speech and I'll and I'll let it happen. Do a fun <laughs> surprised face for the thumbnail for this stream. Smiley you, face. You got it. Okay, let me uh let me let me let me get my camera going crazy here. Um all right, give me a sec, give me a sec. Ready? Ready? Okay. Yeah. Or, or, wait, this one might be better. This one might be better. Or, or, or... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me... Uh, he's, he's this way, right? He's like... I'm gonna give you a red arrow. Or, or... How, how, how pogged out can I get my lips? Let's see. Uh, I, I wasn't doing anything. I wasn't. That, that was that was just for the thumbnail. That was just for the thumbnail. That was just, that was just for the thumbnail. Okay. Um. <clears throat> anyways, Wizard got thirty votes, so um uh uh we, we um we I, uh, he's gonna go to Barbarian. <laughs> he's gonna have rage <laughs> as a wizard. As, as a wizard, he's gonna have rage. <laughs> okay. Gales of Barbarian! <laughs> Guys, I didn't do anything. I didn't. It's, Spencer literally did walk in at that exact moment and was like, "What's happening?" I wasn't doing. I wasn't doing anything. I didn't do anything at all. Then nothing was. Nothing was going. Yeah. Nothing. What's going on? Nothing. Mm. Sounds like a what? No, I, everything's fine. Have you seen the mail keys? No, I don't know. Marcy was playing with them. Yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> she plays with them and then hides them. They all said hi, mom. You have to come speak into the mic. You guys better be real nice to my boy. Asterian? Yes. Look, he's now wearing Gail's underwear. Aw, cute. <laughs> I guys, guess so. What about? Do, are you finally Nikki? Uh, yeah. Narf Narf is now Nikki in Shadow Hearts underwear. Damn. <laughs> Barbizard. Yeah, She's really. Like... We were just watching the Barbie movie. Oh. I love the body. I'm just kidding. Anywhere else I'd be a ten. Is it my destiny to live and die a life of blonde fragility? I'm just kidding. Where she sees love, she sees... No, where I see love, she sees a friend. What'll it take for her to see the man behind the tan and fight? For me, I'm just Ken and I'm enough. Okay, so we're gonna go left or right. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? Um, right or left? There's two two paths here. Uh, that was left and that was right. I guess this is where we just kind of were. I don't actually. I just realized that this doesn't take us anywhere. This, this was this was this was this was a dumb decision. But you guys can vote anyway. So, um, I'm just Ken and I'm enough. And I'm great at doing stuff. I he's just like me for real. In Blade Runner, when 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 uh, when when Ryan Gosling is like God damn it, he's just like me for real. Sublime. I'm literally him. I'm literally just like him. When he's lying in the snow at the end of Blade Runner, and he's and he's laying there, and the music's all like. And it's the tears in the rain, but it's but the but the but it's like blood in the snow because even though he was he was not the chosen one, he still made an immense amount of difference. Like like something stark white, like blood in the snow. Um, he's just like me for real. <laughs> Interlinked. I love that movie. Okay, we are gonna go left. He's also called K. I'm just K. Yeah, he's he. It, uh, when when that was happening in 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 the movie, I was like, "Huh, hey, that's funny." Okay, these both go the same direction. Um. Okay. I hear shouting up ahead. I hear shouting up ahead. Bribe okay. to give Barbarian Gale the birthmite. Oh, bribe to give Barbarian Gale the birthmite? Okay. Uh, vote yes or no. Yes on give Barbarian... Bar 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 <sighs> yes if you want to give Gale the birthmite. No if you want to leave it on Lysel. Even though Lysel is uh, a paladin. Lysel's a paladin. I wouldn't even know if he's proficient in it. 
Seek and you shall find me. <laughs> the party's naked! <laughs> uh, Gail, you proficient in that? He he is now because he's a barbarian. <laughs> We're gonna give it to Gale. <laughs> if you guys vote yes, I'm gonna give Lizelle a normal sword. I can't donate, so uh, I can't donate. So you you want to see this, but I love your content. Thank you for making me smile. Thank you, Dragon's Luck. Appreciate that. They, you you don't have to donate to to be sweet. Um. It is just a little bonus for those who do want to donate, which is why I sometimes take bribes. But it's not because I'm being bribed. It is just because you decided to stop in my stupid little stream on my little channel on YouTube, which my AdSense has got down a lot lately and I've been making a lot less money this past year. And you gave me a little bribe for a little poll. I'm not I'm not letting it sway the decision, but maybe it's, you know, giving us a little bit of, little bit of options, which I like. I like to interact with you guys. Um, and the text to speech is funny. I think it's hilarious. It's like I get to hear your guys' voice. All right, we're giving Gail the birthmate. Oh, this is goofy as hell. Gail, behold, with the birthmate. We're giving him, giving Lysel a quarter staff. Fantastic. You guys, that, I am also broke as fuck. I, I feel y'all. So, um, all this, all this donation money that you guys said is obviously super cool and very much appreciated, but I don't see it for like a month, like at least a month and a half because YouTube pays out very slow. So, um, thank you guys so much. Really appreciate it. Uh, all right, let's make our way. Uh, what's going on over here? Bribe to keep being awesome like you always are. <laughs> thank you, Dreamsy Waro. Appreciate you. Open the bloody gate! Open the bloody gate! Sevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Erdin sucks. Gate, <laughs> I hate him. You let goblins here! Zevlor <laughs> supremacy. I love Zevlor. He's awesome. Please! There's no time! Shouldn't you Bro Bro ran from a place where there are refugees. That he, that, first of all, he is not a refugee from, ran there, and then, <laughs> and then proceeded to lead a pack of goblins to the one place of safety. Aridin sucks. Where is the truth? Cannon! No! Cannon! Cannon! I'm just cannon. Anyone else I'd be a fucking corpse. Anyone else he'd be potential. God damn it, cannon! Will! Will! Oh. oh no! And suffer it sting. Damn! I love that man! God damn, I love Will so much. He's so he's oh. they made his intro so cool. Alright. Lethal or non-lethal. Vote the bribe to get to Lance as soon as possible. <laughs> The lance from from the UA streams. I know we should find a lance. I'm gonna be tormented by a, by all the lance players out there. We're going. We, if you guys, if look, look. I'm not trying to sway the votes here. I'm not trying to sway the votes. But Cannon was killed. These these motherfuckers killed Cannon, and we cannot let that stand. These goblins are. Uh, we gotta send them right back to Maglubiet, or well, what would be the Absolute, which is the new god that they're fucking worshiping now. But yeah, they're gonna die, and they're gonna go to Maglubiet, and they're gonna be like, oops, uh, we started to serve the Absolute on accident. Sorry, Maglubiet. We we have to get justice for Cannon. Hell yeah. Bring those votes in on lethal. I want to push that button and kill these goblins. Yes. Die, goblins. I'm going to multi-attack the fuck out of you guys. All right. Um, let me get a let me get a step of the wind. Step of the wind. No, not disengage. Step of the wind dash. Which one did it? Which one shot the arrow? I got I got to go back. I got to go back in the stream. Hang on. Hang on. I got I'm going to find out which one did it. Let me let me go back. Let me go back. I'm going to go into the cutscene. I'm just going to look real quick. Okay, okay. Which goblin is it? Okay, it's 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 the one next to the warg. It's one that's next to the warg. It's it's this the one. It's this one. I bit my tongue. Ow. Ow. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, it's so painful. Ugh. Ugh. Ow. Ow. Okay. Okay, I'm good. Ow, ow, it came back. Ow. Oh. Justice for tongue. Ow. Okay, it was this one. This one did it. This one did it. I went back on the stream and looked. It's that one. We're going to justice for fucking cannon. Um, run, Narf, Narf, as fast as your little feet will take you. She's going to spin around him for some reason. Okay, okay. That's as far as she can go. Asterion. Shoot him. Uh, oh, Asterion's a bard now. I forgot. Asterion, vicious mockery on this booyag. What did he call? What did he say? Did he say Pizzle? What did he say? We're, we're on balanced difficulty. We used to, we were on Tactician at the beginning, but the chat decided that was too hard, and now we're on balanced because we have some people who are naked and we don't want them to die. Drizzle? He said Pizzle? Drizzle Pizzle? We want the Drow Mommy. Yeah, well, we don't we haven't met Drow Mommy yet, so um, right now we're... Uh-oh. Asterion just got shot. Justice for Cannon. The Horn of Helm Hammerhand. The Horn Horn of Cannon, really. No, no, no. Zevlor, do not. We 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 will avenge Cannon. Ourselves. Drow Mommy can be a companion come act two. Okay, well maybe it'll happen. But right now we have to we have to stay focused, Jan. We have to stay focused. We have to we have to save Cannon. Alright, Can Cannon was shot unrightfully by Aridin's stupidity. <laughs> Gil? Gil was... <laughs> Gil fell on the ground in leathers covered in grease. <laughs> Yikes. Um, alright, Barbarian Gale. Where's our rage? Rage, Gale! <laughs> His rage! His rage, son! He went... He went... <laughs> when when Carlac rages, she's like. Aah! When Gale rages, he goes. Hiya! <laughs> okay, Gale, run! <laughs> Dash, Gale. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> it's like a cartoon character. All right. <laughs> Yeah, Gale's oiled up and raging, ready to fight. All right, Lysel, you can just jump. You don't need to run through the oil. I'll just kill this guy. Get him. Nice. Justice for Cannon. On our mother, die! You, sh you, sh you, you paid for your sins to Magluby it with you or the Absolute, whoever you serve. Oh, sorry, I didn't loot, loot the entire body. Okay, there we go. Okay, we, we also have a grease bottle now, so why don't we just, uh... Let's find through for all of our stuff. We've got a lot of stuff. Where, where, where's the grease bottle? Where'd it go? Where, where is it? Where's the grease bottle? It's gonna have to go into a... <laughs> um, sorry? Did we not pick up the grease bottle? Where did that go? Am I... There it is. Oh, it's just a regular bottle. It's not a grease bottle. Okay, not worth it. Uh, we will just shoot. Not Will. Don't shoot Will. <laughs> we love Will. Barth? I want to shoot Barth, but I'm not going to. I guess I'll shoot the goblin brawler. It went up Gale's butt shoot, Barth. But they're our allies. Should we really shoot them? I mean, I guess they were the reason Cannon was killed. Just saying, Cannon, Cannon wouldn't be dead if it wasn't for Aridin. Vo okay, we're gonna vote. We're gonna vote. Should we attack those stupid, dumb... Uh, you know what? I'm not biased. I'm not biased. I'm not biased at all. If you vote yes, we will attack Aridin and his friends. If you vote no, we won't. We will stay attacking the goblins. It's up to you, chat, really. I, I just put the decision in your hands. It's, uh, I, I didn't, um... I, I'm not provoking anything. I was just listening to you. 
you don't you don't have to make this decision. Uh, we could just we just leave those guys. They have the, they're they could be our allies, and that's entirely fine. Or we can shoot Barth in the face with a crossbow, and if that happens, then uh, I w I wouldn't be particularly upset. I wouldn't necessarily be angry. It's tied. We have to reopen the poll because it's tied. Let's let those last couple of votes go in. Oh, oh, yes. So we will by one vote. One vote. Somebody threw in at the last second there. Well, then. I oh, we don't have our action. I already used it to shoot a goblin. Well, um. Yeah, go, Aridin! Go, 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 Aridin! It was me. It was my vote. <laughs> will right now. Just say. Voting to attack allies includes Will right now. Just say. No, I'm not gonna shoot Will. Right? Look, if that if that ends up being the consequences of our actions here, uh, maybe we misstepped. But uh, let's just do it. We'll we'll do a quick save real quick, just in case we die. But. You know, we're not going to save scum that or anything. We'll just see what happens. The will is too hot to die? Yeah, yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> this scene. Kale raging with Hysterion in the Goku, the dead Goku pose. <laughs> <laughs> run Gale run and do a pommel shot on uh, uh... oh he didn't have enough movement oh well he's not raging anymore damn it <clears throat> uh, well uh, chat voted uh, chat, chat voted chat, chat voted to uh, to to Lizel, can you please take out your short bow? Lizel, why aren't you taking? Lizel, why? Why are we taking out? Why are we taking out a short bow, Lizel? What's going on? Why? Uh, why aren't we doing that? Is it not equipped? Because it's acting like it's not equipped. Well, that's going to take an action to equip that. So we are just gonna just use our action. Fantastic, love that. Thank you, video game. <clears throat> oh, okay, let's just, uh, let's just, uh, uh, oops, uh, oh, oops, oopsie, oh, how'd that happen, uh-oh, uh, no, we'll just, we'll just jump down here and get into the fray. Oh, no, Gale, getting attacked by a warg. <laughs> she lost the birthmite that made Lizelle angry. Yeah, I know, right? We will avenge Cannon. Friendly fire, it happens. It just means you want to be friends. That's why it's called friendly fire. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Oh, Will helped Asterion! That's great! That was so nice of you. Gale! R rage against the dying light and uh okay it's just kind of a sweeping attack so i mean yeah it should be fine okay that 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 didn't that didn't work but we did do some damage to, we did we did do some damage which was good good job gail oh geez okay lizelle do you have your bow equipped finally um let's let's run down here okay let's just do uh let's just do a little um Let's just, uh, let's just shoot. Dude, the bow is bugging out. It is just not working. Yeah, the bow, the bow is, it's just not working. That sucks. Uh, I'm just gonna run in. Divine sense. Inquisitor's might. You are an ally. Weapon attacks deal additional 3D damage. 3, 3, 3D damage. 3 damage. Let's do, um, let's do, let's do Gale. Gale, get that damage. Inquisitor's might. Alright, let's just, uh, okay, we're gonna... Compel duel on Barth. Good command. 
All right, we're just going to attack this goblin with multi-attack. And... Oh, oops! Oh, it was a misclick! Oh, I misclicked! I misclicked. Sorry, guys. Sorry about that. Oh, oh, dang it! Oh, shoot! I crit! Oh, oh, oh well. Asterion's alive again! Good. Get in there, buddy! Uh, let's do, um... Let's do, uh, let's do a healing word on... On, uh... It, on... I, you know, there's not a whole lot he can do here because he's only got his action. So we'll just play old-time battles with his violin. Oh, on Gale? Okay, we'll do a healing word on Gale. To protect Gale and his oiled-up, naked, naked ragingness. Now, oh, why'd he heal? Who healed him? He, he drank a potion? I mean, oh, good, he's alive. It's fine. The button under the bow isn't pressed? Oh, am I just stupid and just not pushing a certain button? Playing the violin in his underwear, yeah. Oh, double ba Oh, Barth, dang it. Dang it. Oh, Barth died. Uh, oh, the warg's dead. That's good. That's good. Um, okay, uh, we're just gonna... Gale, attack the goblin, Gale. What are you doing? G Gale, just just hit the... Go oh, Gale. Oh, when he gets in a rage, he just goes... He just oh, he just goes crazy. I don't know how that happened. Oops. Anyways, um... <laughs> Target can't be an ally. Lazel, <laughs> <sighs> smite out Aridin. Lysel, smite Aridin. Oh, oh, shoot. Oh, darn it. Ah. Justice for Ganon. Oh, dang it, Will. Did you see that? That was crazy. Oh, crazy miss input that happened there. Yikes. Um, well, I guess we'll do a compelled duel on... Uh, we can save our spell slots. Uh, anyway, we should take care of these goblins. Should should really deal with them. Now kill Will. No, I don't want to kill Will. I don't want to do that. Kill Will? Kill, kill Will? I mean, I mean, it's up to you. You guys do whatever you want, but kill Will. I mean, he's cool. Did you see the way he stabbed that goblin? He was getting vengeance for Cannon almost quicker than we would were. And if it, there's anybody that that we like that Narf Narf likes, it's it's it was Cannon. You know the way he was gonna pull that bridge up for us and then got shot down. Gone too soon, really. Um. <clears throat> oh, good. Oh, good. That's great. I'm glad we're not gonna kill Will. Yeah, he's he's a real nice guy. I, don't, I wouldn't want to stop that. He he wasn't the reason the cannon died. He he was just he was just here to help. Cause he's a he's a sweet boy. Um, let's do a Tasha's hideous laughter on this bugbear. <laughs> Dang it. Dumb. Oh well. Guess we'll do an offhand attack. I like that none of them question that we just totally killed those guys. <laughs> Yay! We did it! Another one down! What the fuck did he just do? <laughs> I know he threw a potion at Gale, but it looked like he just slapped his ass! <laughs> he just slapped Gale's ass! He just slapped it! It was the heat of battle. Nobody saw. Gale was just like, <laughs> we killed those guys. Gale was just like, damn. He just went. Will wants a piece. Damn. All right, uh, Gale, kill him. That was good. Good turn, Gale. Drink a potion. You earned it. All right, Lizel, kill this bugbear. Lizel, what did I say? Narf, Narf, I guess you gotta clean up all out here. You just gotta, just gotta take everybody down. 
<laughs> nice. Broke his back with her toes. There's still another goblin? Oh, yeah, the one we pushed. I forgot. Let's turn someone inside out. <laughs> Let's turn someone inside out. Asterian, you crazy guy. Don't do that. That's evil. Yay! That was the last of them. Inside! All of you! More may follow! Nobody's torn up that Aridin's dead. Nobody cares that he's dead. <laughs> That's how much of a shit he is. I don't know. Take all of his stuff. This place doesn't look like much. Mm, take all of his stuff. And take all of your stuff. And of take all of Barth's like stuff. It. Oh, a brass locket. <laughs> Mm, take take bugbear stuff. Take the warg stuff. I think we're encumbered. Uh, we are. And then take this brawler stuff. And then we're gonna go into our weight. And we're gonna just get rid of the most weighted stuff, like this freaking armor. Whoops. Uh, send that to camp. Send this to camp. There we go. Now we're good. All right. Let's be on my way. Stealing? I stole. That's a crime. They're going to be bad. No, they're not. Stealing has caught someone's attention. What will you do? Uh-oh. Um. Uh. Uh. Mm. Oopsie. Right to immediately steal the druid idol, then immediately sell it to the kid who tries to scam you by selling you a fake magic ring. Um, okay, that could be an option that we do, uh, that I will give to the chat, but, um, hey guys, uh, we, we were caught stealing, um, look, I know you guys like to loot everything all the time, and I was just following orders, uh, so, uh, just, um, I'm just, uh, just, what, 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 what do we do about this? Maybe a little gold could smooth this over, um, or we could just hand over the stolen items, or attack, we're gonna attack, what about cannon? <laughs> Uh oh. We can also try to talk our way out of the situation. Right to take out the entire grove. <laughs> oh no! Guys! The whole grove? I don't know if that's gonna go over very well. We're level two. I think if we want to take out the entire grove, it would be better to have a plan of, of attack, of strategy. Okay, we're gonna try to talk things over. I think, I think that's good. I think that's the smart thing to do. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, try to talk our way out of the situation. Um, we can say a deception check. There, did you see? The thief making a run for it. Or intimidation. Go on, accuse me of something. See what happens. Or persuasion. I have the faintest idea what you're talking about. I've seen nothing unusual. We have a minus one to deception, a minus one to, to intimidation, and a minus one to persuasion. <laughs> But going along with Nerf Nerf's character just makes the most sense to, you know, be as intimidating as possible. That's definitely along the lines of how we've been playing her. Look, I I, 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 I was just helping out by, uh, by, by getting you guys to, to get some cool loot and stuff, so, I mean... <clears throat> okay, cool, we're gonna do a little intimidation check. This should go fine. So this will be okay. Uh, go on, accuse me of something. See what happens. It's a DC-15. It's got a little bardic inspiration in there. Come on, Asterian. Oh! 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 Asterian! Oh, thank God he's a bard. Oh, thank God he's a bard. You've been given the benefit of the doubt this time. <laughs> tells you next time you won't be so lucky. Great job, everybody. Poggers. We wouldn't have been able to do that if Hysterion wasn't a bard. Oh, okay, let's make our way into the grove. Is there a little conversation happening over here? Um, alright. Let's, uh... Oh, I guess I should ask you guys if that's what you want to do. Um, okay, here, here, here's, here's our options. Here's a... No, Cannon! Damn it! Okay, here, here's, here's... There, there's a lot of things we can do right now. There's a lot of things we can do right now. And a lot of you guys have been pulling at potentially uh, getting Minthara and taking over the Grove. So that involves 
really not interacting with the Grove too much and going to the Goblins. So I think that is going to be our big, our, our, our poll that we're going to do right now. And I'm going to leave it at about a minute, uh, a minute and 30 seconds. I'm going to give you guys 90 seconds for this on um, whether you guys want to go to the Grove or not. Go into the grove. So the option here is just to go into the grove. And then option two is just go to the goblins. Um, I'm sort of just taking on a lot of what all of you guys seem to want to be doing and sort of pulling that together as a conglomerate of a of of our of our brain ted poll. So going into the grove doesn't necessarily mean we're siding with the druids. It just means that's what we're gonna do next. But if you guys that don't want to do like that. More loot to me canon. <laughs> Cannons loot! Oh god, oh god. Poor cannon. I guess we'll loot cannon. Even though their mourning is death. Actually, I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna do this. I'm gonna wait till everybody votes. Because we may just not interact with the, the druids at all. Um, and we could just go straight to the goblins. Um, also, going to the goblins doesn't necessarily mean we side with them. It just means that's the direction we're gonna go. So, entirely up to y'all. Um, if you guys want to go into the grove, we could totally go steal the idol, or um, we can go do some quests here and, um, you know, fuck with these druids, or we can just go straight to the goblins and try to find a drow mommy, which seems to be what everybody wants to do, which is totally fine and not a way I've ever played this game, and it'll go so well, it'll be great. Send them all to meet cannon, it's what's most merciful. <laughs> when are we reaching level three? Guys, we almost have, we have 32 XP to level three. We're almost there. Drowussy helps Saza. Yeah. Majority of our votes here look like we're going to the goblins. We're gonna go find the mind goblin. Why is everyone naked? Ask the chat. Don't ask me. The chat, the chat did it. Wait, my ch I I'm XP to level three. Wait, where? That's almost. That, that's almost XP to, to me. I, to, I'm. That's. That, I'm XP to level three. It's me. It's I. It's, it's, I, uh, uh, uh. Wow. I hope we hit level three. Should I just leave it like this the whole time? <laughs> Hey guys, what are you playing? Wait. What are you guys playing? What are you guys doing? Oh, no, no. oh don't mind me. You guys almost um, XP to level three? Oh, there, there. Mm -hmm. yep. 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 I'm sorry, I got distracted. <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> level three almost. Yeah, we're very close. Okay, we're going to go to the goblins. We're going to the goblins. Even though there's a merchant up here, but you know, we'll just we'll just we'll just leave. It's fine. Let me out. I'm going to the goblins. They seem like fine fellows. Even though they killed Cannon. You know about these parasites. Will we survive? Oh. Only if my people extract them. The only other cure is the blade. Okay. Wonderful. Okay, wonderful. All right, making our way. XP to level three. We must fulfill the prophecy. We must fulfill the prophecy. We got to get the XP. We got to go kill something, I think. Um, we, we definitely got to do it. You good? It's really fucking hot outside. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, uh, oh, I see. Okay, no worries. Um... All right, y'all. We gotta go rest. Yeah, we're gonna go rest. I think I think we'll do a little short rest. Well, some rests better than none. And the potential we have right now, which is going to the goblin encampment, is over the horizon. We have lots of different ways we can go right now, though. But but that is gonna mark. Um. Uh. That's that is that is gonna be where we end the stream today. Um. Because. Uh, this is this is four hour stream so far and that's about our typical time limit to, to do that and also um, uh, mom is 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 simply begging 
Mom needs help with something. <laughs> Mom needs I'm help with. Not just being mean and telling him to get off. No, of course help. not. No, 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 no. I, I, and I want to help can I, you. Can I get a? Can I get a one more look at my mask? Oh, at at Asterion? Yeah, I'm yeah, like for a sure. Powerpuff character today. Oh yeah, you just can't. Oh, you're the adult. Yeah. <laughs> you're a Powerpuff character. Um, there he is. Ugh. Look oh, at both of them. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> These fits. You guys have appeased mom. Congratulations. <laughs> Mommy is in charge. I will. Yeah, I will be making a recap video probably out of the next three videos um, and stuff. Oh, are you saying bye? Me, me, me. Thanks, everybody, for joining. This was insane. Um, thanks for all the donations. Appreciate you guys. And um, <laughs> hey, yeah, Marcy, I know. I know. We're going to go to the goblin encampment next. When we're probably going to kill everybody in the name of Drow Mommy. So, um, all right. Thanks, everybody. See you guys later. And uh, that's the end of the stream. Bye.